lovely bubbles. Today we're gonna play the game called Mail Time, developed by Kela van der Dijl. I think it's Dutch. I'm so sorry, my, I can't speak Dutch. Published by Freedom Games. And the text is, it's mail time. As a newly trained mail scout, put on your backpack, grab those letters, deliver them across Grumblewood Grove. The forest animals eagerly await the side of your mushroom. Head in this cozy cottage core light pl platform adventure. Oh, it's a platformer. Oh, okay, it's also in the tags here. Exploration, platformer, cute, and female protagonist. It's already looking insanely cute. So let's see what this game is about. Um, I'm gonna start, of course, a new game. Never played this before. And I'm a mushroom. <laughs> I'm already looking so cute, dude. Okay, this game is gonna be very wholesome, I think. Um, pronouns. So you can choose between these three. Uh, hairstyle. There's butterfly hairstyle. Oh, I see why. Warmy. <laughs> then you're having a heart. Oh, it's very cute. The art style reminds me a bit of Hello, Hello Kitty. Um, I tried to recall Hello, Hello Kitty, but I never had anything to do with this. I think... I think... Maybe a bit. I have no idea, though. <laughs> Congrats on your Spotify release by the... Th super Thank you very, very much. Thank you. It means a lot to me. <laughs> it means a lot to me. Thank you. Then we're having this branch. <laughs> this is cute. <laughs> um, and um, the little plant here growing hair color. I think I'm going to take the branch here. My, my hair color. So um, I'm a brunette person, but I wouldn't mind having pink color or red hair. If I'm going to show this character to my mom, she's going to say, hey, that's, this is remind me, reminding me so much of Pumuke. <laughs> A very, very old German show. I don't think this is even existing anymore. I'll take this one. Skin color. Can I be Widowmaker? Oh yeah, there are different ones. Do, 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 do. But I can't be Widowmaker. Okay, outfit color. Red. <laughs> That's very cute. Very fitting to my mushroom hat. But I also like yellow and green. Oh, I like all the colors. I like these pa pastel colors. Pumaka, a bit, right? I'm not sure, was this even a German telly show or uh, from Switzerland? I'm not sure, uh, quite sure. I never watched it. I never did. But I know it's existing because my mom was showing me that. It's from Switzerland, right? Or is it German? Because Pumuckl, that sounds a bit like South, maybe South German. You watched it sometimes, so it is maybe still running. All right. Is Dominic's favorite food, please? Don't eat this mushroom, though. I like red a lot. I think it's fitting very well. Backpack. Oh, that's the leaf. Stop. No, no, no. Okay. Oh, you can also stop it. So we don't need to wait. That's good. Oh, that's a very cute backpack. I would also wear this in real life. <laughs> Looking like a basket or your laundry a bit, right? Or oh, for a picnic. Oh, well, that's a big belt there. A backpack with flowers. <laughs> I'm going to feel like a big squirrel, dude. <laughs> I see. Bavarian, basically. Yeah, Bavarian. Yeah, sometimes I'm having hard trouble to understand. Not understanding. I'm understanding Bavarian, but it's quite hard to, um, to hear the difference uh, if it's Bavarian or people from Austria. Sometimes they're talking very similar, but the Austrian people, they also have a very special uh, accent, which is also very lovely. Didn't know of it, so I had to Google. Apparently, it's West German, Austrian, Hungarian, Austrian, Hungarian. Damn. Okay. Humuckel. <laughs> yeah, that's a very old German show. Yeah, it's from Munich in Upper Bavaria. Mm, interesting. I struggle with Bavaria. <laughs> uh, yeah. I would say, in case you don't know um, the story between uh, the rest of Germany and Bavaria. Bavarian people don't have a good reputation here because there were some politicians. They were always like, um, we want to separate Bavaria. We're doing so well as a, as a single state. The, the other states, we are like 16 states in Germany. They're always dragging us down. Of course, nothing happened. Nothing. <laughs> Bavaria is another. Yeah, that's what other 
other people are quite often saying to be fair swearing is much worse than Bebe. i wouldn't say worse um actually i like dialects and accents a lot it's it's nice from the linguistic perspective it's always nice to hear it's so like i <laughs> i see bavaria exit yeah no nah, that's on, honestly only older people thinking this way the younger people are not like that no but bavarian people are very proud of their estate that's what i figured out it also i think you can always say this about all estates the person who's coming from hamburg they're also going to be very proud the person who's coming from berlin as well i think that's understandable Oh, people do be silly sometimes, right? <coughs> Brexit. <coughs> uh, East German is quite difficult for me to understand, but it sounds funny as hell. Uh, yeah. Yeah. It, sometimes it's hard. I, I, I <laughs> found it a bit funny when I'm watching news and they're putting some subtitles on, on people who are speaking Bavarian. <laughs> it's, uh, it's always uh, funny to see because they're assuming for the rest of the German people, they're not going to understand that. It's wonder there is no Finnish politician advocating for Quavolla qua exit or something. What is Quavolla? There is no East German dialect. There are multiple... But I guess they are, when we're talking about that, then we're talking about the very typical one we're hearing. As a, as a non-East German, it's also hard for me to understand. You can also say this, Bavarian dialect is not just one dialect. There is Oberfränkisch, Unterfränkisch, There's so ma there are so many. And there is Deep Bavarian as well, but it's, it is Bavarian, it sounds like Bavarian. I find it funny when people say Low German, it's hard to understand. Like I have no problem, but I can't really speak it. Yeah, I I can't do any dialects, to be honest. Maybe, maybe a bit, just a bit, but it's very limited. <laughs> it's very limited. Where were we? Backpack, right? Actually, oh, this is also nice. But I think I'm going to take the acorn. I'm going to be a squirrel. Squirrel? Backpack color. Oh, this is nice. I like these colors. Also nice with a button here. Oh my God, everything is so sweet. I kind of want to have this backpack in real life now. And I would 100% wear it. A glider. Oh, that's probably the, the sticker here, right? Oh, no! Wait, I can glide? Zeldi? <laughs> Kovola is a city and municipality in southern Finland. Actually quite close to my city. Ah, okay. I guess uh, these thoughts are just existing everywhere. People want to separate their state from, yeah, from the rest of the country. Well, I'm glad nobody's listening to these people. Okay, that's a big letter. <laughs> it's also very cute. Looks a bit bloody though. This is looking um, also very nice. <laughs> the letter is so very cute. It's very creative. It, oh, of course, Wood Daily. Of course, it's a it's a newspaper. Okay, and then oh oh, this is very cute. I'm gonna take this one. That's also what I'm doing. I'm having those fake, fake um, flowers, and when there is a birthday um, or Mother's Day, don't forget. By the way, we're having Mother's Day uh, this Sunday. Don't forget that. In, at least in Germany, I think uh, it's a bit different in some countries, especially with uh, Father's Day. Um, <laughs> but I just wanted to remind you, there is Mother's Day coming, so don't don't forget it. Yeah, <laughs> I think I'm going to take this one. Same in Denmark. Yeah, I think it's very similar. Yeah. Person from the Baltic coast of uh, Mekpom sounds nothing like, say, in southern Thuringian, even though bo both is East German. Yeah, something, but I think you were taking this um, very specific here. I, I know what Thug means with it sounds um, like East German. Like, he's, I think he's talking about the typical, hast du mein Euro? Like this, you know? Same in the Netherlands. I thought so. It's. I think Mother's Day is uh, very similar, but maybe it's uh, it's a bit different in the U.S. But Sunday is my getting sober from fasting. <laughs> well, you can get sober with cake and coffee. Mm -hmm. I think that's a good idea. And I think I'm also done with my my character. And I'm going to call myself Mimi because that's my name. Um, I think I look very lovely. It's looking like my, my shoes are looking like pots for flowers. <laughs> All right, let's go. 
<laughs> That's cute. You've got mail. Are we there yet? Uh, no. Mm. How about now? <laughs> no. What about... Stop it! Will you shut up if I tell you where we're going? Promise? All right. Now don't get too excited. But today is your first solo delivery. What? Yes! My ears. Wow, Janet, you... I think Janet is not really happy about us, huh? Are we, are we there? Oh, wait. I can actually do this. Give me a second. Um. Are we there yet? <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm gonna stop. <laughs> uh, right, so... Are we That's also just voice. Okay, so if you've, uh, <clears throat> so you've got it right. You just need to explain me how this is working. Uh, yep. Wait. No. <laughs> One more time. Listen closely this time, then. You. You, Mimi. Me, Mimi, and Chad. You need to deliver that letter in your backpack. To someone named Greg. Wasn't there another game where we delivered something to Greg? That was also a very cute game. We're gonna need that voice for the rest of the stream. Yeah, I need to work on the redeemables. I need to work on the redeemables. I'm still waiting until Roadcast is bringing, bringing me a, a granny voice. Otherwise, I need to do this manually. <laughs> Deliver letter to Greg. Okay, since it's your first day on the job. First but not least. Right, uh, yes. Uh, you probably know a bit about what it's like to be a male scout. Yes, sir, Janet. <laughs> I mean, ma'am. I'm top of my class at male academy. Oh, well, I'm in the top ten. <laughs> Ish. <laughs> it's cute. I like this humor. Ish is... Yeah, I'm barely hitting it. But I'm ready to learn. Well, it's one thing to learn from the books. And another thing to learn in real life. Mail Scout official handbook, page 12. Good one, Janet. Try me uh, on another one. Scout, what do we say about the interrupting thing? Not to do it? Yes, please try. Before you're ready to deliver your letter to Greg, we should do a practice run. See that turtle over there? <laughs> Look at this turtle head. <laughs> Oh my god, is that a bee in the background? Oh, everything is so cute. I want to give them this note for me. You might just get something special for it. In case you forgot how your legs work. You can use WSG to walk around. Aye, aye, Captain Yan. Oh, Yan, you're here. Be right back. It's done for Janet, I guess. <laughs> Look at this bee. It's so cute, though. It's even hanging with having a face. Reminds me of fun it's drawing and, and guarding phone. And not garlic phone. Okay, um, Mr. Turtle. <laughs> Hello. Hi. Hi, are you here for an autograph? Um, do you have to get mail signed before I can deliver it? I don't remember that from the handbook. Oh, no. I meant, do you want my autograph because I'm famous? <gasps> Maybe Shelby's a big streamer. Jenna tries to eat that sandwich for two hours but always gets interrupted. <laughs> I guess so. <laughs> That's only because of me. I don't like bugs, but bees are kind of cool. Bees are so important for our environment. So it's important. Actually, I was listening to radio today and they were talking about that a bit. It was, uh, yeah, it's kind of frightening that we're not having many bees left and they are so important for our world. Oh, what for? Wasp? <laughs> Wasp are also important. People are underestimating that. Hmm. Bugs are cool. It reminds me of the movie. What was it called? Bugs World? Wait, wasn't there a PlayStation game? My mom loved to play that. I was watching her playing this game. Was it called Bugs World? Not Bug Snacks. <laughs> Bumblebees don't want to get near them, but it's fun to watch them fly out. They're super cute. Hi, Babuva. Hello there. Welcome to the stream. I'm a track star in training for my next race. Let me guess against the rabbit. Speedy Shelby, they call me. Maybe we're understand underestimating Shelby here. Your name is... Your name is Shelby. Then this letter is for you. 
Oh, fan mail? Of sorts? Let's see it then. This is a fake letter. Just pretend that you're reading it. Oh no, Shelby's gonna be so disappointed. It's her first delivery. Oh, <laughs> oh I see. Is that your supervisor over there? Uh, that's Janet. She's my boss, yeah. Uh, or something like that. I'm not really sure. In that case, I accept this letter. <laughs> it was delivered to me following mail scout protocol. I'm ex oh my god. I'm ecstatic with the service I've received. Five stars. No, wait. A four and a half star. <laughs> Why the four and a half? You didn't want my autograph. <gasps> Oops, sorry. Uh, by the way, by, by, by the by, <laughs> do, do you happen to know where Crack is? I'm pretty sure that's a little mistake here. Shall we? Nice name for it. Yeah, I think so too. Could be also a nice name for a bird, to be honest. How's it going? Uh, we just started the game, actually. Um, I decided we're gonna we're gonna play lots of different kind of uh, small games this throughout this week. So, uh, maybe we can focus on a bigger one next one. Uh, next week, <laughs> not, not next one. <laughs> how are how are you doing, Babuva? I hope everything is all right. Not currently. My brain is on sport mode. Information irrelevant to exercise can be accessed right now. Maybe. <laughs> Eckbert. <laughs> Look at this cute picture. Maybe Eckbert knows he's clever. Squirrel man can't miss him. It's a squirrel. Asking around is the best way to find people around here. Thanks for the tip. Bye, Shelby. Peace out, little scout. <laughs> Look how cute he's just weaving. <gasps> All right. Um, okay, we don't need to go there. Are you going to tell us something new? Chief Janet, I'm back. Visibly. Um, I heard you gave the letter to Shelby. Huh? How did you hear that? Wasn't easy to miss. Uh, good job, Scout. Mm, that means you've earned your first patch. Uh, dear Scout, congrats. You've earned the... The stamped and signed patch with a love meal scouts. Woohoo! Um, okay. Can I see this somewhere? Yippee! <laughs> so as scouts work in a patch system, once you've done something noteworthy, you earn a patch for it. With every patch, you get a little bit closer to being a real mail scout. This is also reminding me of the game Lake a bit, where we were delivering some packages. That game was so good, by the way. Why do we Yeah, that's I think that's uh, what I'm trying to have. I mean, we're always playing variety games, right? Kinda. At least I'm trying to to show some some indie gems, but my my backlog is kind of full with small games as well. So uh, I wanted to give it a go. And you get a little bit better at mail delivery. For example, you might have noticed that you can jump by pressing space. No, I didn't, but now we know. Well, by holding space, you can glide as well. <gasps> That's amazing. I'm literally never gonna touch the ground ever again. <laughs> <laughs> this is how I felt with Chia, actually. That game was also good. Well, sure, why not dream big? Anyways, uh, when you deliver that letter to Greg, you get your official male scout patch. You be full male scout for real. <gasps> I can't wait! Good luck, Mimi. I'll be here if you need me. Thanks, Mom. Um, I mean, Mrs. Male. I, I mean, Janet. Ah, bye. Uh, don't forget... You can press H to check your deliveries and patches in your handbook. Perfect. So that's going to be my journal, some kind of. Mm -hmm. Okay. And there is some automatic saving. Let's see this journal. So we have deliveries. This is my quest log, pretty much. For Greg. I need to find Greg then. Um, and then I need to tap out. Here. Oh, these are all the, the people here, I guess. Complete new first assigned delivery. Greg. Animals talked. Okay. 25 delivery. Oof. Talk to all animals in neighborhood. Also a bit of Animal Crossing style, right? Scout of the month. 50. Glide for 15 minutes. <laughs> for 60. But probably not everything. <laughs> like, pro it's probably counting for everything, right? A young Tia today on the PS4. Oh, that's nice. Are you going to play it? That game was really good. I don't think you can glide for full 15 minutes, though. Find five trinkets, find 20, find 40, the letter in under 30. So, oof. 
take over 50 minutes to deliver your letter. Uh, deliver a fan's letter to their idol. Sample some rare mushrooms. Deliver meals instead of meal. <laughs> uh, deliver an anonymous love letter. Oh, chat. File an official letter of complaint. <laughs> Prevent a crime from taking place. Collect five rare coins. Clean up the forest. There was actually another game in my feed. I think it was called something with grave seasons. I think it's going to be a farming game, but every time they, it, you were doing something or after a day, there, somebody's going to get murdered. I was uh, very interested in this one. <laughs> Quickly checking out the graphics though. Um, FPS limit, unlimited resolution. I'm not sure if that's the highest. High epic, shadows, yeah, medium effects, epic, textures. I hope it's not going to kill my PC now. Um, do I need to restart though? Safe and safe game. Did something? Yeah, it's looking better now, at least on my end. Uh, no, we don't want to go back. And uh, yeah. Well, okay. One last thing. What is it? <laughs> Fifty minute at once. <laughs> That's, uh, sounds like a lot, huh? Uh, what? Uh, where is uh, Greg again? Does it say on the envelope? Oh no. Then how would I know? Go ask around and figure it out, kid. Mm, cool, 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 cool. I can't do that. <laughs> All right. Yeah, it's looking way better. Um, do you know where Greg is? Oh, it's you again. The scout that didn't want an autograph. Oh my god, he, why is he looking so mad now? I'm actually scared now. I think I'll play it after my next game. Good idea. It's actually also not that big, so um, it's it's a very cozy game, yeah. Let me gobble my sandwich in peace. <laughs> well, I'll show you when I win the running championship. In six weeks, my autograph will be worth a thousand. Mark my words. Do you tortoises usually win races? Nope. Tortoises are super slow. Everyone knows that. But don't worry about that. Grumpy Shelby? A bit, huh? But I understand him. Cause this lean, mean running machine is 100% bona fide turtle. At least that's what my dad said. Oh well, in that case, does this turtle often win races? Uh, no. Not yet yet. Not yet. I've really been pushing myself. But I don't think I'm gonna get good enough. In time for the race. Daisy the hare always wins and even though we're best. <laughs> it's a rabbit, dude. Rabbits are so fast. Oh my god, I'm so excited to see the rabbit. I mean the hare. Oh, that's even better. I even said this before. There's a sweatband on the show. Yeah, I saw it. So it's very cute. It's very hard, hard melting. I'm, I'm constantly about to say, oh, 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 but I can't do that. <laughs> I don't know, I guess. <clears throat> I don't know, I guess I don't want her to think I'm struggling. But the socks always <laughs> get second. <laughs> so they must know some socks. What was the game called where we also played with socks or S socks? There was also by, by um, I was about to say Danish, no, Dutch people. Where's Fox? So maybe there's going to be Fox, yeah? There's just going to be some kind of trick to running that I haven't figured out yet. You could you take this letter to Sox? It's a fake note, just a friendly checking up on the competition. But really, you interrogate them and get all the trade secrets. Sounds like a plan. A bit of a harebrained scheme, more like. Speaking of hairs, why don't you just ask Daisy for advice? Uh. Once upon a jest, that was the game. That was fun to play, huh? Maybe later. For now, here's the letter to Sox. Come back when you have all the secrets a runner could ever need. Okay. Now I'll get two. Uh, this one. Inventory. No. So, two letters. Do, 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 do. Oh! I'm, I can actually glide. Oh, this feels super smooth. Boink! <laughs> well, I'm jumping very high. I didn't expect that. <gasps> Hello there. Can I talk to you? No? 
It's just decoration. I thought we I can talk to Miss Ladybug. <laughs> it's very cute looking. Is that is that the hair? Da -da -da -da, da -da -da. Yeah, that reminds me of Bugs uh, Bugs World, I think it was called. How can I get up now? Can I just climb here? No, my character can't climb. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Look at the buttons. <laughs> All right, Rabito. Hello. Oh my god, you're looking cute as well. A smart rabbit. This game looks very... It is very cute. <laughs> We're hard melting. So when do we get their crowbar and when do they have... Hopefully there are no head crabs here. No, it's a cozy night, Pan. Cozy. The Arce is very cute, y'all. I like the, um, the style a lot. Psst. What? Oh, hello? What's going on? You have to whisper. I'm afraid mom will find out what happened. Your mom? Yeah, her name is Daisy. Oh, your snow job. She's not close by. Even with big ears, she won't be able to hear you. Okay, if you say so. What did Snowdrop do? Well, I have a problem. I've got a bit of a problem here. I love the stars. They make me feel so excited. D did you know that stars are really far away? But with a telescope, you, <laughs> you can't see them as if they're very close. But Ravenholm was also cozy. <laughs> no. <laughs> Remember how much fun you... No. No. One, it was actually one of the worst places in that game. No. No, just no, pal. Stop teasing me. <laughs> it's not cool. For sure, it's like you're right next to the stars. But that doesn't sound like a problem, really. Well, I was looking through the telescope at the stars. Scope, uh, scope <laughs> at the stars. There was a meteor I was trying to see. Uh, meteors are like stars that are flying. In. Did you know that? No, that's so cool. <laughs> I was trying to find the meteor. I was swinging the telescope around a bit. Turns out I was swinging it a bit too much. Before I knew it, before I knew it, the telescope was broken. And now the stars are far away again. Can you help me fix it? Not a problem. It looks like uh, the lens is broken. It's a bit of thick glass inside the telescope. Oh, I know what part you mean. So the lens from a pair of glasses would work? Um, that could work great. Okay, well, I did... So I see Oops, I'm so sorry, I clicked too fast. It was either near Kiki or Donna. I think Donna is a frog. That might be something for something here. I'm still mad that I'll cancel that one spin-off based on Ravenhall. Would have played that, I'm, I'm pretty sure, yeah. Those meteors leave behind the trail of <laughs> meteors. <laughs> don't worry, Snowdrop. I'll figure it out. Thanks, Mimi. Please don't tell mom. Wouldn't dream of it. Mm -hmm. All right. Um. So that's another quest. I guess I need lenses. Maybe I'm going to get this by helping another person or animal. Okay. Where's your mama, though? Wait, is this a kettle? <laughs> it is. This game is very creative. Do we need to go inside? Where's your mama? She's not here, we said, all right? Let's go into this direction. What an amazing perspective. Is that a bike? <laughs> Can I use this? Oh! I guess I'm finding a way to glitch a game a bit. There's a window here. I wish that would be a map. I'm gonna get lost here for sure. Da, da, da. Da, da, da. Oh! I really wonder how big the world is. Is that Daisy? Hello, or another rabbit. Oh, who are you? <laughs> They're playing a game. Oh, that's a big carrot. I mean, probably a normal carrot. Um, I found something. What is this? 
Aquamarine Crystal. Apparently this gives you protection during battle. Battle? I don't want to battle. Mm -hmm. Like the colors in this game. Yeah, it's not dark at all. This is what I need right now. I'm extra mad because another Half-Life protagonist was supposed to turn return in it. Mm. And they completely cancel it. Yeah. Valve doesn't need to do, doesn't need to de develop many games anymore. They're making so much money with Steam. Hello, dear. I don't believe I've seen you around here before. Can't you join us for a cup of tea? Ah, uh, no, sorry, I'm on the job. Thanks for the offer, though. Ah, uh, the name's Annie. Nice to meet you. My name is Mimi. I'm a male scout. Today is my first day. <gasps> Wonderful. You're just... You're just who I was looking for. Really? What a coincidence. Oh, I need to ask you a big favor, hon. How big? Oh, like gravel big or stone big or rock big or boulder big. Um, not actually that big. <laughs> oh, there's a goose. I need to deliver a letter for me to Haley. Heck yeah. Luckily for you, that's my expertise. But... It's a secret letter. You can't let Haley know I sent it. Any the suspense. Please tell me what's in it. It's just some things I think she needs to hear. What kind of things? Like good things, bad things, funny things, scary things? Mimi. Less imagination. More mail delivery. Please, I want to ask unless it was important. She's the nervous type and I happen to know there is something big on her mind. I hope this will help her calm her nerves and let her do what needs to be done. Okay, fine. I'll do my job. Quietly. <laughs> imagine, imagine in real life you would just talk like this to everyone. Super long. <laughs> Thank you, honey bun. Now run like the wind. Bring me an anonymous note to Haley. Whoosh. <laughs> okay. Oh my god, I think my heart is going to melt with Haley as well. Are you Daisy? I hope you're Daisy. It was far into development too. Crazy that they dropped this. If if they were that far. I wonder why they did. Maybe there is always time for a couple. Of, true. True for especially. <laughs> especially for hot chocolate. Oh my god. Look how I'm sitting there. I'm a patient listener. <laughs> Hiya. Oh, this is Daisy. The mama. Daisy's my name. Running is my game. <gasps> What's up? If you ever need any vegetables from uh, from the farm, just let me know. <gasps> Will do. I don't have any space in my backpack right now, but maybe another time. You're always welcome. Um, I need to get space for... Dude, this carrot is way too big for my backpack anyway. Da -da, da -da. So, Daisy lives here. Sometimes it's looking like I'm about to drop through the map. I want to have this as a mount. I mean, ladybugs are also able to fly. Oh, I can do boink boink. Otherwise, I don't think... Oh, there's another way or... I'm not sure if the world is ending there. Is this Pikachu a bee? <laughs> you mean my bee? That's a B, I think. <laughs> da, da, da. Oh, that's another area. Maybe the dog is living here. It's looking like a pond. Look at the boats. They're made of oh, the made of paper. How cute is this? This is insanely creative. I love that. Da, da, da. Mm -hmm. Or maybe the frog is living here. Because it's a pond, you know? Mm. Hello! The water is looking good. I'm surprised. <laughs> da, 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 da. Da, da, da. <laughs> the boat. Okay, there is lots of TNT here. Um, Wait, what? You've earned? Take off patch? Why? What did I do? Let me see. Uh, clap for one minute. Ah, okay. Easy clap. 
<laughs> but bees do not have red cheeks. <laughs> They're just a bit shy. It's a shy bee. <laughs> Why is there TNT though? Is that a mouse? Dude, what are you doing here? No, it's a rat. Yeah. <laughs> Swamp. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, Lord, I'm happy to see someone. I'm seeing you, right? Oh, uh, am I hallucinating? Oh, uh, you're not. Irene did warn me about sniffing the grunt gunpowder. <laughs> Why are you sniffing gunpowder? <gasps> but it just smelled so good. Gunpowder? Yeah, you know? Boom! <laughs> That's the junket of this town. You scared me. Don't worry, I'm very experienced with things that go boom. Name Swamp? Boomstick Swamp. Demolition expert of the most elite group of super... <gasps> I mean, of the most elite group of super friends here in Grumblewood. Elite friends? Yes, no further questions. You haven't happened to run into Irene, right? Long Weasley? Uh, why? No worries if you hadn't spotted her. She's very sneaky after all. She should be in the wallet eavesdropping. <clears throat> Saying hi to a certain cat. But anyways, any chance you could give uh, Irene the secret intel? She told me not to leave my station. A letter to deliver? Unheard of? What? I mean, I will do. Ah, uh, one more thing. Or a spy group. I mean, a friend group. As a secret code, we, um, we, we say to each other, so we know who we're talking to. Surely there's other ways of recognizing who you're talking to, right? Sight, sound, a touch? Smell? Please don't me go on. Don't make me go on. Well, always the best way when, when you talk to someone in our pus. Pus? You say, remember we've never met before. Uh, okay, got it. I hope I'm not going to forget that. Now go off and chat to Irene. Okay, bye. Icebreaker patch. Uh, okay. Um, ah. For a second, I thought I bugged it out. Icebreaker, get to know your neighborhood. My neighborhood. In the hood. Da da da. Da. Um, why are the bones here? <laughs> Do not ask further questions, Mimi. You might get answers you won't gonna like. The weasel. Where's the we Is the weasel actually hiding or? I'm very surprised that... This game doesn't feel wonky or chunky. Not chunky, but wonky, you know? <gasps> Who is this? That's a bat, right? Pop. Oh, look, a male scout. And such energetic specimen at that. <gasps> Tell me, scout, what's male scout handbook rule 72? Oh, no, it has. That's easy. If the sender no longer wishes the sent to uh, the sent mail to be delivered, the postage item must be rapidly destroyed by means of fire. If no fire is possible in the area, stomping on the postage item is also acceptable. Did I get it right? Heck, if I know. You seem convincing to me. Can I ask what all you, what all the baskets are for? I'm a mushroom collector. Oh well, experience of mushrooms collectors. Mm, I don't want to have them. I just want to see them sketch them. Have a little taste and then move on. Do you only eat the edible ones? All mushrooms are edible. It's a mindset thing. Oh no. <laughs> bats, but also bats. I'm actually not a huge fan of bats. I'm very scared of them. <laughs> I don't think that's how it works, but you've managed to live this long, I guess. I don't suppose you have a fun little side quest for me here. No, side quest, no, sorry, but. I think we saw there is a batch where you're collecting some mushrooms here. Oh, shucks. Instead, I have a mushroom. What? Uh, that's a mushroom mission. Gee, I'm, I've never done a mushroom before. What do I have to do? Look at me, Mimi. What am I missing? Arms? 
<laughs> the answer I was looking for was samples from all the unique mushrooms in the area. But sure, you're not wrong. <laughs> Gosh, I'm so sorry. Ah, uh, don't be. I mean, arms are the wings here. All you show me is you've got working eyes. Anyways, this uh, this area, the Grumblewood Grove, is great for mushroom growth. And I want to experience them all. But I'm not as good at sampling them as I am consuming them. That's where you come in. With your unique skills at finding and delivering mail, you're perfect, perfect for the job. Does that make me an ecologist too? Uh, once you collect enough samples, I'll tell you about the first three and we'll go from there. The Amethyst Deceiver is a purple mushroom that likes swampy soil. I think we have this one already. It's probably around here somewhere nearby. Then we have the purple pinwheel. It's a purple mushroom with a peculiar shape. You know what I mean when you see it. It's almost like a flower or jellyfish. Lastly, you can look for the indigo milk cap, which is probably more blue than indigo. It likes nutrition-rich soil, so most likely it, be, it will be near vegetables and other growing things. Hmm. But I think I got the other one near the... Near the... Um... The carrots, right? Flying foxes are really cute, though. I tried to remember... But I think you're uh, you're right. But bat bats are kind of creepy for me. I don't know why. They have, so they have very big eyes. There you can scout. Now be on your way. Uh, okay, see you in a bit. Um, don't we have that? No, that's a crystal. Oh no, this is not what I found. Right? Tough. That usually means me. What's in your mind? The mushroom samples are on my mind. I can't find them anywhere. I, I didn't even look. Fear not. I'll just remind you what you're looking for. Okay, just repeating now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's it, baby. You can do it. Doable. Oh. Hello? Da, da, da. Oh, there was some interaction here. Boink. 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 Let's see what's on top. I can see why it's called uh, a platformer. <laughs> That's cute. Oh, I found something here. What's that though? Um, grape soda bottle cap. A, bur a purple, not a purple. A purple bottle cap that is certainly unique and not seen anywhere else. Or somebody wants that, I think. I would assume so. Okay. Well, there are going to be so many animals here. I'm going to get lost, chat. This is such a big area. I need a map. Please, can you sell me a map? I'm the post girl. I, I should get a map, right? Oh. What's this? Some kind of a coin? Collectible towel coin. This coin is so heavy. It must be made out of super... Uh, some super metal. <laughs> I was about to say it looks Danish to me. God, it's a goose! Oh my god, it's so cute looking! I'm dying. <laughs> I don't know why, but goose are also super cute, right? Fiddlesticks! Uh, Penny, for your thoughts? Oh, I just... <laughs> Look, it's blushing. <laughs> Hello, dear Jared, welcome to the stream. It's, it's just a case of just... Oh, never mind. Oops! That's okay. Words are hard sometimes, right? Just give the ones you don't want to say. What's on your mind? Ah, uh, don't worry. That's a personal matter. Uh, what you've got for me, little scout? I have no idea. But it's an envelope, right? Uh, yeah. But inside, inside of it, who knows? Not me. You'll just have to roll the dice on this one. All right. Here goes. Who gave you this? No one? <laughs> Des, thank you very, very much for the bits. Thank you. Very kind of you. Thank you very much for the support. And for the bits, of course. Thank you, thank you. Quack. Quack, quack. Also, what's in it? I'm really curious. Look at the bee in the back. It's cute, right? <laughs> yeah. It's a letter saying I need to drum up the confidence to do what, what will make me happy. 
It's not a bad idea. I just think <laughs> I'm a bit in over my head. I would like to formally request that you spill the beans immediately. All right, but only because you asked so nicely. I um uh, have a crush. What? On Donna? <gasps> oh, the frog girl. We need to find the frog girl, though. And I kind of want to ask her out. <gasps> you seem to be breathing a bit. <gasps> a love quest! How do you want to do it? What's the plan? What do we need? Well, that's the po problem here. I want to give her something special to show I care in a special way. I'm not sure what to do yet. Let me have a think. Come back in a bit. Okay, okay. Yep, I can wait. No problemo. I can wait. I can wait. Can I? I'm curious. Poor Hallie from Annie. So, what if I'm just gonna talk again to Haley? Hey, little scout. Did you figure out? Whoa, whoa. Calm down. We just talked. But yes. -ish. Oh, okay. It was good that we talked to, to the goose with an instant. No. Well, is there anything she mentioned she likes? Ah, uh, Donna likes all sorts of things. That's the problem. I can't think of anything extra special she might like. She was talking about some kind of special spoon. A spoon? Yeah, I think it was called a love spoon. What's a love spoon? <laughs> it's supposed to be a spoon that one lover gives to, gives to another. I don't really remember what she said about it besides that. Was a little bit lost in her eyes. Would a normal spoon be fine? <laughs> I think we need to find a love spoon. Hi, Defaris. How do you find all these super cute games? Actually, you're not the first one asking me that, but there is a super nice newsletter by made by Wholesome Games. They're having also having a very nice website. They're doing um, they're also doing it twice a year, I think, doing showcases of uh, games coming soonish, and they're very much focused on. Like the name is saying, wholesome games. I am highly um, recommending the newsletter. You're getting this once per month and um, giving you a hint of the good little gems, I guess. So you're missing Charity Fallen? No, 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 no. But I'm also always checking out um, new releases over SteamDB. Then I'm just look looking through for, for a whole month. Every month I'm doing this pretty much. A love spoon? Is that an alternative name or cuddling position? <laughs> I was thinking the same, yeah. <laughs> no, 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 no. The love spoon is special. I'm sure about that. Can you please help me figure out more about it? Sure. There's no spoon I can't handle. Thanks, Vinny. I can really use the help. I'm a bit too nervous. That was just so cool and calming. Sadly, she can't help me out with this one. Maybe start by asking my friend... Um, but the love spoon is that Hammond <laughs> is that a hamster oh my heart is gonna melt again if anyone knows anything about love spoons it'll be him he can chew his way through book like no one else chewing s in reading oh Zaza would be so good with this task mostly yeah here I've jotted the situation down give this note to Ham he'll know just what to do all right be back spoon Okay, I'm bugging out the game a bit. Oh, what was that? <laughs> um, I got a new badge. Deliver your first letter, or what? I think so. Take over 50 minutes to deliver a letter. Okay. Okay, Haley. We need to find more people now in this big world. I also want to get hiker on here. Do you see that? There's some stuff going on there. I'm so curious. Is that the love spoon? That's a very big one. Is this what we talk? <gasps> oh! Hi! <laughs> They're all oh, they are waving so cute. Edward! Ah. <sighs> I can't believe kids these days. Uh, what's up, Egbert? Egbert is also such an old name, huh? Oh! I didn't see you there. 
Uh, you, shouldn't, you shouldn't sneak up on an old man like that. I'm right in front of you. Maybe you need glasses. I mean, he has some glasses. Is that a love work? Yeah, it seems like a love work. <laughs> Egbert is looking like uh, he's having lots of knowledge, to be honest. Ah, uh, never mind. Well, let's have a look then. Who's this? Ah. Maybe I really do need new glasses. <laughs> Beg your pardon. Y who are you? Mm, no worries, sir. I'm new around the stretch of the woods. I'm a male scout here on official male scout business. Amy, nice to meet you. Egbert, likewise. You sure about that? Well, don't let me distract you from, my, you, from your work. Okay, see ya. Unless... Unless what? Unless you'd be willing to help an old man out. Everybody needs my help. <laughs> oh. Like a little side quest? See it as a way to gain experience. Well, our number one rule is to serve the community. Actually, it might be rule 38. Anywho, uh, what's the sage? Uh, sage? A situation. <laughs> sage. Okay, I never heard of this word. Dude, I feel like Egbert now. You youngsters and your slang. Well, my upstairs neighbor is getting on my nerves. Seems to be in the nature of upstairs neighbors. <laughs> sure. <laughs> the blast of rock music at the most tiresome hours. Like 8 p.m. And the nose is driving me insane. I go up there and speak some sense into them myself. But my, my days just aren't what they used to be. So if you'd be so kind. <laughs> Could you hand them this formal letter of complaint? Sure thing, Gramps. Uh, thank you for your trouble. For the trouble. Okay. Is that a bird? I think it's a woodpecker. Oh my god, it's gonna be a woodpecker chat. <laughs> and this is looking like a fork. But I can't take this. Never mind, I need high ground. How to get high ground. Not like this. Is that a birdhouse? No, that's a well. Moing. Moing. How to get high ground here? I need to talk to bird. The woodpecker. I think it's a woodpecker. I'm not sure though. Oh, over this. <gasps> Look at those apples! Did we talk? Is that the weasel? I need to talk to the weasel, weasel first. No! Oh, well. I messed it up. But luckily there are mushrooms. Hey, bro. That's the weasel. Weasels are also looking cute, right? Da -da 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 -da. High, wind, high, high ground is always good because of the overview. Um, Widowmaker just as a mushroom and without, the, uh, without a gun. That's an apple tree. The apples are looking fancy there. Hey, Ro. Hi. What do you want? Uh, Irene? Depends on who's asking. <laughs> um, remember we've never met before? Ah, I don't remember a new recruit. Well, explain yourself. Oh my god, Irene. <laughs> Irene, please, let me just do my job. You've got, you've got mail. Actually, I need to do this way. You've got mail. Or should I say secret intel? <gasps> you shouldn't say that. Oh, sorry. Well, in that case, I have a completely normal letter from Swamp. What's that rascal doing roping civilians into our operation? Let's see it. Reminds me of an illustrated book I had since I was little. Bonnie Ferris, I actually love illustrated books. Um, until today, I'm, I'm still buying them. They are insanely beautiful. They're just insanely beautiful. If there is a version of a, of a literature, it's an illustrated version, most likely I'm going to get that. I tried to get them, actually. Oh, we have a stay hydrated here, chat. So players are reminded to stay hydrated. I actually need to drink something. We, <laughs> we need a new avatar with a funky cap. Actually, yeah. Would look very cute, right? And a, also an avatar with a hoodie. What does it say, players? Um, did you play Two Point Hospital? It's a voice line from the from Two Point Hospital. Oops. Here you go, one top tier example of a normal letter. Good night, Darian. Sleep well, yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna have to go now. Don't cry. Don't cry. 
Have a nice day tomorrow. Take care. Nothing secret about it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, okay. Uh, difficult. I'll have to think about it. What did you say anyways? Since it's totally not secret at all. Hmm, clever one. Well, he asked about his part in my... I mean, <clears throat> our plan. I guess he's getting impatient without instructions. But I'm unsure what to tell him. What do you mean? I'll tell you some other time. Yeah, if you're in the, in the grift now anyway, could you run by Kaz for status? Of <gasps> That's another bird. I can see a bird. I beat. A beak. Oh my god, I can't speak anymore. Top secret. Aye, aye, boss. He's up in that cave near the blue windmill. Curious fellow. Hope he doesn't give you any trouble. I hope so too. Why should this cause trouble? Good night, fam. Good luck, Rick Fruit. Thank you. So all these quests are in kind of dependencies of other people. I found something else. Collectible flower coin. A very pretty silver coin with a flower on, on it. It looks really unique. Okay. Um. Yeah, I wanted to get high ground, right? But who's this? I'm gonna get high ground after this guy. Um, you're hoarding lots of money there. I mean, coins. What are you doing here? Hey, Ro. Oh, this is Kiki. <laughs> Mail scout, come here. Oh, that's Big Bell there. Oh, if you love illustrated books, maybe one day I'll show you mine then. I've made an illustrated silent book for an art school. Really? I would love to see Onifaris. I'm a huge fan of illustrated books. I had no idea. You guys are so talented. That's so nice. Everyone is doing something else that's amazing. I would love to see Onifarius. I need you to send a letter for me. Kiki, I also need to talk to you, to be honest. Oh? Watch your sending. A cease and desist. Um, to each child that crossed me. That seems a bit overkill. I'll have you know. This child robbed me in, in, in broad daylight. I was walking with my coin collection. The back was open. I was letting the coins breathe the fresh air. <laughs> then I was interrupted by the vermin child. I think the name was Satter. It's a rabbit. Another rabbit. What a yoinker. I can draw stick man pretty well. <laughs> Um, I definitely know your uh, drawings from Guardian Phone. They were not too bad. Chad was loving your your graphics over there. We were always laughing a lot. My talent is to eat a lot. <laughs> but I'm also having this talent. <laughs> she saw the glinting of light and she was fascinated by my coins that sound like a very special bird. In German we call them Elz, Elz, uh, Elzna? No. Something like that. Elst, Elster. I actually forgot the name. I don't think I ever saw them in real life. I don't think so. But I'm also very bad with wild birds, to be honest. Uh, but I only had so long to walk before I had to get back to my business. The landlord business, you see. Elster. It was called Elster. Mm -hmm. Thank you. <laughs> Truly time consuming. Anyway. I must say, seeing a young fellow coin enthusiast, it was nice. It, it's not a popular hobby around here. I gener generously offered that setter and admire my coins. For one hour only. And bring them back immediately. Well, Scout, it's been 61 minutes and my paws are empty. <laughs> I must resort the, to stronger measures. Or else this child will walk all over me. Nobody messes with Kiki. Don't you think this is disproportionate? Setter is only a minute late. If you were paid to ask questions, wouldn't you be called a question scout? Well, I mean, ah, oh, but you aren't a question scout. You're a male scout. And I have mail for Setter. Sounds like cheddar. So why don't you run along and deliver it? Magpie, they were calling magpies, yeah? They are, they, I heard they like to, to yoink all the, all the shiny stuff. Just is great uh, at Guardi phone, right? I agree. I remember the, the drawings very well. Also, newbie's drawings. 
fine. But also, do you, Des? I think you were a bit tipsy when you were playing. <laughs> so that was also funny to see. <laughs> yeah, those those evenings were literally the best. I really enjoyed my time there. Glad we agree. Well, I've got so many quests now. Da, da, da. Adventure patch. You've earned that. Okay. And what's that? For what? What am I earning for? Find five drink. Oh. Easy clap. Mm -hmm. Anything hidden here? Oh, you got lots of coins, dude. But he said he's collecting them. All right. We wanted to get high ground. It's nice that I'm always getting a little boost. Do you think I can fly there? Yeah, I can. Easy. Easily. Da, 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 da. Maybe something here? There's so many things to discover. <gasps> oh! oh, well. Is that honey? <laughs> it's honey. Yeah. Da, 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 da. Well, now we're having high ground here. Oh, <laughs> it is a woodpecker guy. Wow. Hello there. Cutest kid. That was epic. Thanks. Wait, what? Getting up here without, you know, wings. Our wings must be hella convenient. Getting anywhere is a breeze. Or should I say, on the breeze? <laughs> You're funny, Miko. You're one of the male scouts, aren't you? Reporting for duty. Gothic woodpecker. <laughs> a punky one. So what's the search? <gasps> That's what I said. When? Uh, oh, wait. I remember. Uh, no. No, I don't. <laughs> well, I was talking to Eckbert and I said, what's the search? <gasps> I can't imagine you, the look on his face. Must have had the Gram Street flabbergasted. Yeah, I can't say you understood. Uh, he told me to hand you this. Mm, blah, blah, blah. Noise, music, blah, blah, blah. Third strike, official warning. Ah, oh, those sure are a lot of words. Uh, but too bad I'm not reading him. <laughs> There's music in my soul. And I just gotta let it out. You feel me? No, that would be unprofessional. <laughs> oh, you're talking about the music thing. Uh, well, I do all send out my tunes from time to time. Same, same, Paul. But I can't help that my song isn't nice and chill. Enjoy, enjoy the food later on, yeah? Hopefully you can get something nice, does. Just not like other birds. <laughs> Just goofing. Other birds are chill, even Cass. Who? Ah, don't worry about it. You run into him if you're cool enough. So what about Eckbert's letter? Uh, just tell him, like, what I've... Oops! Even something as moving as that. Uh, well, um... Will this do? This is a used napkin with crane riding on it. And most importantly, a stamp. Well, I guess it's it qualifies as a letter according to the male scout handbook. I'll be on my way to Eckbert. Hold up a sec, little bud. Pro tip from the Clearmeister. Hold space to glide down on the breeze. Nice and chill. Thanks, I'll give it a whirl. Okay, we are, we are heading back to Eckbert. Who's this? Or, or, or what's that, uh, that on the top? There's a baguette, dude. Is that a picnic? There are pancakes. I need to go there now. I'm too curious. That's a picnic. <gasps> it's a blanket with lots of pic... Oh my god. What was that? So cute. <laughs> it's a pie. Oh my god, this looks amazing. <gasps> a cheese platter and crackers. Oh my god, and oh my god, olives. I love olives. 
game looks so amazing. So creative as well. Mustard and jam. Mm, and pancakes. I was wa <laughs> I was wondering what this is. That's a big baguette. You like the food? I'm trying. <laughs> Hello, Ham. You must be Ham. Ham, I am. My name is Ham and I like jam. I also like working out reading and long jokes on the beach. But those don't rhyme with my name. What a shame doesn't rhyme with this name. Who is to blame that his loves do not rhyme with this name? Such pain. And also lame. Okay, Shakespeare, rein it in. I'm here on a love quest. Oh, sorry, I don't really do romance myself. But you seem like a fun person. I'm sure you'll find somebody good soon. It's not for me. Read this. It's the hot, hot goss straight from the source. If I understand this right, Haley wants a spoon from me? At this point, any intel regarding the love spoon is appreciated. If you happen to have one, that's all the better. Of utmost importance, essential to my happiness. Stop reading already and give the scout some spoon info already. Hey, be nice, letter. <laughs> oh, it's crying. Even extremely buff hamsters have feelings too, you know. I think Haley's just a bit nervous. Well, I'm not too sure about what the whole love spoon thing is about. But I do know about love. I thought you said you didn't do romance. Ah, uh, not first and of course, I'm not trying to get cooties. But in the books I read, love is all about the dramatics. Just making a grand gesture like running through the rain to your beloved, holding up a boombox. <laughs> no. I don't know something like that. What was the question again? I have a different question now, actually. Was there a very handsome shirtless man on the front of these love books? Um, what? Yeah, how do you know? Just a hunch. I bet he knows that the handsome, handsomer the man, the truer the words. No. Anyways, that's the love portion of this love spoon thing covered, right? I mean, I can give you a spoon, I guess, after two. My lovely, amazing, humongous spoon for efficient eating. <laughs> and a small spoon. I need to eat lots fast, so I can give you the big one, even though it, it is better. You can't do any serious eating with a small spoon. It just doesn't fit nearly enough food. You need to eat lots of food to get both. You, you don't have to fit all the food in one spoon, you know? You, you take scoops with a smaller spoon instead. Sounds fake. <laughs> Anyways, it's okay. Our Haley says this. Love spoon is not normal anyway. But thanks for the offer. I'll write down my advice at least. Maybe she has some use for it. Oh, actually, why don't you ask Toph about the love spoon? That was the bad, right? Toph and Donna are good friends. I still didn't find Donna. Maybe they heard they say something about it. Who knows? Oh, good idea. I think there was also another item in here. Oh, yeah. Is that a bottle? Da, 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 da. I think so. <gasps> I found a piece of bottle. <gasps> There's even wine here. Damn. I need ch cheese platter for you. <laughs> I love cheese platters. They're super delicious, yeah. And with nice crackers. And welcome back. This bottle's broken edges are so sharp. I have to be really careful not to get hurt. Mm. Da -da -da. Oh! There's a battery. But I will... I'm not gonna make fun. Mission abort mission. Oh, can I go inside? No, I can't. What's that though? It is a dirty napkin. Yuck! Who would just leave a used napkin lying around? A lot of people are doing that, unfortunately. Oh, oopsie. Da, da, da. How am I supposed to get there? Oh, like, like that. Oh. A battery. Discard a battery. I wonder if this one of those magic cylinders that can bring objects to life. <laughs> it's an interesting perspective to think like that. So I did a big turn here. Okay. Oh, there is something else here. Kind of important to get high ground to see everything. And there is a rabbit reading a book. Wink. Mushroom sample. This sample is for the wrinkled peach mushroom. For top. Ah, okay. Wait. 
It was not telling this is for. Ah, uh, maybe that's for later. Not for delivery, though. Okay. You're only eating cheese when it's melted. <laughs> I see. Hello? Hi there, little bookworm. <gasps> I'm not a worm. I'm a bunny. Basil the bunny. That's such a cute name for a bunny. You have fooled me. So Basil the bunny, watch a reading. Oh, it's just a book on geology. Nothing special. Nothing special? Rocks are the best? Give me a rock fact. Mm, okay. Uh, so rubies and sapphires, right? The red and blue gems? Yeah, yeah. Uh, apparently they're made of the same mineral called corundum. Is that weird? They look nothing alike. That's incredible. So they're like siblings that are totally different? Tell me about it. Sometimes I feel like me and my siblings have nothing in common. None of them like to read like I do. None of them care in the slightest about geology. I care. You do? Yeah. Listen, Basil. You go and read some more rock facts. And I'll swing by to hear whatever cool fact you lean next, learn next. <gasps> well, thank you. I'll get right to reading. <laughs> oh, a piece of apple. So many collectibles here. I mean, if I just leave it, it could be become an apple tree. Maybe. As long as it's not plastic. Da, 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 da. I'm, I'm trying to figure out the whole map. <gasps> Who's this? <laughs> and litter bug patch. Da, da, da. Uh, pasta with gorgonzolas or gorgonzola is very, very good. Having a strong taste. Also, the smell is very strong, but mm, the taste is really good. Even though I don't like bluish cheese that much. I wonder what grape soda tastes like. Maybe there is a drop left inside. Crumpled soda can. Who are you? Hello? Letter for socks? <gasps> is this socks? That's me. That me. Give here. <laughs> The grumpy face. Who? Who sent it? Uh, yeah, yeah. It's from Shelby. Oh. Uh, Shelby the turtle? No, no. Must not be important person. <gasps> but he thinks he's a big streamer. Oh, okay. What say? Do you want me to open the letter? Yeah, yeah. Socks no more toe. You don't have toes? Not since accident. Well, not accident. Long story. No toe, no grip envelope. Mimi, do. Open quick! Uh, but it's not mail, Scott. Protocol for me to open someone else's mail. Look like socks here. Uh, open fast! Uh, okay! Shelby wants to know how your preparation for the championship race is going. Ah, running! You spark joy. But you don't seem to be doing much running right now, socks. Did you forget uh, how? Socks never forget our run. Grandpappy good runner. Teach Socks running fun. But he run too much. Break all legs. No. Grandpappy say run fun. Can no run no fun. Take easy also important. Capiche? I think so. You're saying that it's important to rest and not push yourself too hard. Mm. See, see. They're, they're not quick trick to be fast. Eat healthy. Tie laces. Sleep only on left side. Non matter. Passion matter. Resting matter. Socks run fast in championship. Socks win. Doubt not. I'll cross my fingers. And toes for you. Was fun to have toe. Enjoy while last. Uh, tell Turtle what Socks say. I can only deliver letters, sadly. Could you write down what you said? No, take letter back. And tell Turtle what Socks say. Oh, sure, I guess. Bye, Socks. Leave, don't talk. That was a grumpy one. A very grumpy one. <gasps> there was something else here. What is this? Shiny. Rose quartz crystal. Did you know pink quartz only exists because of a hunt gone wrong? <laughs> okay. Duh. Um... Is that a worm? 
It's the trash bin. Cheese. Can't believe I'm inside the trash bin. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. Mm -hmm. I can see something shy. Is that a snail? There are so many things to discover, chat. It's insane. Um, I need to bring back some letters again, right? Music is also cozy and amazing. Yeah, I agree. I agree. I feel very comfy. All right, I'm gonna grab this one. I hope there is uh, nothing shiny here. Wait, there is something here. Is that a sock? What is that? I like that I'm getting a little boost. No, it's another cab, right? Blast. Berry Blast Bottle Cap. Blast its berries. I love berries. Da, 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 da. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's something shiny over there. This whole world is shiny. <gasps> no, no. But I found something else. I got distracted because of another shiny things. Ah. Da, 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 da. Collectible earth coin. This bronze coin has a hole in it. That's so cool. Just have to go to Denmark. Da, 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 da. Mm -hmm. Where was the shiny thing now? Here somewhere, right? Oh no, over there. Um... Okay, how to do that? <laughs> Probably just by flying here. Oh! Going up, 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 where the honey is, and then crossing. Wait, I didn't go, I didn't follow this way though, because I was going, I was about to talk to the woodpecker here on the other side. Aha! Another coin. Yoink. Collectible mushroom coin. What a bright coin. It's so shiny. Looks like it give me a power up. <laughs> Mario, Mario! Da, 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 da. Oh, there are two items. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wait, is that a human? No, what's what's going on there? No, there's another villager. Pine brew bottle cap. What does pine taste like? Tree power. Da, 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 da. Uh, you know, this game reminds me of it here away. I need to look up what this game is, to be honest. Tear away. Now I'm curious because this game is amazing to play. A jump and run adventure uh, game. Platform PlayStation Vita. There's no way I can play this game. Oh no, you can also play it on the day PlayStation. Ah. I never heard of this one, uh, Josh. Looks interesting. I will check it out after stream. Where? Okay, wait a second. There was another item here somewhere, right? Da, da. Is that a rocket? No. It's a bottle. <laughs> Wait, no, it's a potion. <laughs> Rocket. <laughs> okay. Mushroom sample. The rat cage is such a peculiar shape. Sh a mushroom. Sadly, it stings. Blech. Waiting for Fenexa to play a racing game. Actually, 
I never played a racing game on stream, yeah. That is true. Wait, is that just another rabbit? Did we talk? No. Setter? <gasps> yes! Oh! I mean, depends. Uh, who are you? I'm Mimi the Male Scout. In training? What was that last part? Uh, nothing, nothing. Unfortunately, I have a not so nice letter for you from Kiki. Oh, crumbs. Kiki's gonna make a lucky rabbit food charm out of me. I just know. Oh, no! Why? If you give him his coin collection back, I'm sure this all blow over. It's just the thing. I lost all the coins. I'm be beginning to see the problem. Oh, this is why I'm collecting all the coins, maybe. Need for speed underground stream. I'm, I'm not even quite sure. I, I played so much Need for Speed back then on my PlayStation. Oh my god, the soundtrack was so good, though. So look at the one. <laughs> I met Kiki while he was walking by here. As soon as I got my paws on the collection, I hopped off searching for a great spot to admire it. But I didn't realize the bag was still open. Not all the coins are lost and I have no clue where they are. Please, can you help me? This is why we're collecting them. Uh -uh. I'm afraid of what Kiki will do if I show up without them. Fed not, little bun. I'll get you to I'll, I'll get you those coins back. Thank you so much. There were four coins in the collection. Please come back when you found them all. Um, I think we found them. Do you have all the coins? Maybe all four. I'm bugging out a bit, huh? <laughs> Hot diggity dog. You're amazing, fantastic, stunning, breathtaking. Now we'll never forget this. Here, I've written an apology note to Kiki. Could you take that and see the coins and, and take the coins back to him? Maybe now I can still make it out of his, this little life? Turns out you're not only male scout in training, but also lucky charm prevention service. Seems there is a good money in that. It's my first day and I'm already holding a bag of priceless coins. <laughs> oh, no, no, I'm nervous again. Please bring the, the note and the coins to Kiki, okay? I got it covered, Setter. Okay, we're not bugging out anymore. Well, that was good that we were uh, looking around then, huh? My problem is, I don't know where Kiki was. He was chilling here somewhere. Where the tree was. The tree um, was full of coins, I think, here. Da, 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 da. No, this is the beginning. No, 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 no. No, he's here. I got your coins back. Here, bro. I have them. <laughs> My coins. Guess you are at least a little capable. And there's no one. There's a note from little setter too. Let's see what she has to say for herself. Mm -hmm. Shoot. This kid clearly respects me. Not sure why. And she obviously loves the coins. Oh, darn it. I'm gonna do something I said I would never do. What? Scout this collection. Oh, the priceless. None of these coins are really important. This one, though. That's my favorite coin. The first con I ever earned. Selling apple juice as a kid. As a kid, I was writing my own letters to deliver. I'm sure that made you rich like my apple juice stand made me. Ah, uh, well, not really. Even though this coin means a lot to me. It shouldn't be gathering dust. It should live well on in a new collection. Bring this coin to Setter. Oh, and this letter too. You know, it please wouldn't hurt. But I'll do for a setter. <laughs> da, 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 da. Oh, a coin, a connoisseur patch. Connoisseur? Bum, ba, dum, ba, dum, ba, dum, ba. Okay, let me see. Mm, this one. Kiki's very first coin. You can be holding. This is special. <laughs> um, and look at all the stuff here, right? Collect five rare coins, clean up the forest. Ah! Is so is this the forest? I think so. So we're setter again. <laughs> I need a map so I can see where they are standing. But I think I found setter. They are neighbors. Whee! 
<laughs> Give it to me straight, Scout. Will I live to see another day? How about you read this and find out for yourself? Oh, nuts. Wait. What? Holy pie in the sky! Did he... Did he really? Yep, he did. Made me have my first coin! Yippee! What are you gonna make? What are you gonna name your coin? Are you supposed to name them? I don't know, but it feels right to me. Uh, well, then I'll name this coin Mimi. Oh, Because he saved me from being turned into a lucky charm. Oh, another thing. Here, take this drawing I made. <laughs> now you'll have something to remember this by as well. Thanks, Setter. That's so kind of you. All the things are yours. Now I must direct my full attention to Mimi. Uh, oh, coin Mimi, I mean. <laughs> I got that. See you later. <gasps> One thing is done, chat. Coin Mimi. Mimi coins you. <laughs> yes, and you can invest in them. Mm -hmm. Just like bitcoins, huh? Mimi coin. <laughs> I see. A drawing Sarah gave me to remember our coin-filled adventure. For Daisy, it's saying, though. Uh-huh. And I need to figure out this part. I think I need to find the, the frog. Da, 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 da. Where's the bat living again? I need to I need to talk to the bat. Da, 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 da. But I think I also need to talk to him, right? Egbert? Yes. Got a response from Clarence for you. Crypto NFT sponsored by Fenexa. Yeah. Uh-huh. Sure thing. <laughs> Day one morning, give me a You've got the crackers in chat. The took crackers. They sent you this postage stamp and all. What else? Well, I never... I can't believe that scoundrel. They won't listen. I will have to escalate the situation. I really hoped I wouldn't have to do this. For their my own sake. I must file a formal complaint to our landlord. Whoa, that's quite a drastic move, my guy. Um, I mean, are you sure my good client patron, sir? I had hoped it wouldn't come to this, but it must be done. Well, anyway, can you take this to Kiki? You already had it filled out? Well, yeah, not the let now things are getting serious. This is what I'm telling to my birds. We're gonna kick it out soon because if we're doing too much music. Not music, we're too loud. The birds are too loud. Just like the woodpecker. Well, yeah. Wait, they weren't going to listen anyway. Could have saved me a trip off that tree. It wasn't a great learning experience. And what will you learn from talking to your landlord? Bureaucracy? Surely there's one of those patches for that. Um, yeah, there is. Don't fuss about it. With all this experience, you're sure to earn some kind of patch. I'd better. All right, back to Kiki. Dude, Kiki is rich, dude. Rich Kiki. Mm-hmm-hmm. That's why you have all these coins. Hi! A scram kid, I'm busy. Unless you've got something for me, don't bother me. Ye okay. <clears throat> you've got mail. Correspondence from your loyal tenant, Egbert. Who? A squirrely looking feller? <clears throat> he requires your aid in settling an oppressing interpersonal dispute. Um, what? It's a formal noise complaint against Clarence. Oh, uh -huh, okay. Go ahead and file it with the rest of the complaints. Oh, <laughs> he's not taking it serious. Uh huh. <laughs> uh, I was cleaning out my wardrobe yesterday, and I found a jacket. And when I was when I when you were sixteen, I loved out loud so hard. I'll I have to show you later. Okay, I'm very curious. <laughs> What kind of jacket is that? Very curious. I was <laughs> reading the first part in a minute voice. I'm cleaning up my wardrobe. <laughs> um, so what is he doing with all those formal complaints? It's kind of important. Why? Um, shouldn't you be invested in the well-being of your tenants? Kid. 
I'm invested in my investments, property, capital, wealth. As long as they pay their rent, I could care less. Isn't it couldn't care less? Couldn't care less. It's a college jacket. I'm very curious to see, dog. Eh? Could care less suggests you care at least a bit. You're running me around in circles. Go run in circles elsewhere. Huh. You want a letter to deliver? Here, it's for Eckbert. Scurry along, shoo! And <laughs> poor He doesn't... Wow. He's just thinking of the money. Money, money. Uh-huh. Okay, but I got a new patch. Mini got a new patch. Money, money. The bureaucrat one. No. I can't find it. Da, 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 da. Eggbird, where are you again? Somewhere here. Da, da, da. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I think this is meant with the forest, so we found everything here. Hero! That cat's going to get what's coming to him sooner or later. Please don't fight, my landlord. How do you respond? Something about how he's a big capitalist egghead? Oh, and he gave me this letter. Huh? Your complaint has been noted. We are looking into it. <laughs> that sounds so familiar. And they're never doing it. And to further notice, he didn't read the letter, did he? No, I don't think so. Oh, unbelievable. You know, back in, back in my day, we had manners. Did you? Me? Well, no. <laughs> I was quite the impressive bad boy. Oh, okay. If I do say so myself. <laughs> oh, dear heavens. Annie just remembered. Annie, who was that again? Oh, Annie versus to today. I got so caught up in all this that I let it slip again. It's hard to think straight with all that noise. Could you please take this note to Annie for me? She's over at the farm with Daisy. Sure. And please don't let her know about all of this. <laughs> Egbert sounds like an old German name. Yeah, I agree. I think it's also just an old name here in, 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 in English. <laughs> I think that's why he's called Egbert. No problem. Be back in a fiffy. Uh, in a jiffy. <laughs> in a fiffy. <gasps> all right, I need to find Daisy again. Daisy was at the... No, that was the other rabbit. That was the kid, right? Da, da, da. But we could also go back and talk to the turtle. Da, 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 da. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, that's the beginning. Da, 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 da. Mm -hmm. I still. Oh, you can see the the lens is definitely broken. Oi, oi, oi. I love this game already. It's very wholesome. The story. I love the story. I love uh, the humor a, a lot. Straight down my alley. I have a letter for you from Socks. Hey, this is my letter. <gasps> oh yeah, their message is mostly verbal. The gist of it was nothing matters as much as passion and rest. That's it. No trick to it. They did mention something about sleeping on your left side. But it wouldn't work. Sleeping on left side? Haven't heard that one before. I'll start tonight. Shelby, that's not the point. Tricks aren't going to work. But if I can't find some kind of solution then... I'm gonna lose the race. No one will ever think I'm fast ever again. Then no one will remember me. There won't even be a speedy Shelby marketable plushie. I'll just be washed up and forgotten. <laughs> that's that's a bit pessimistic, isn't it? There's still lots of time to find your stride. Maybe Daisy can help me. But I'd hate for her to see me so insecure. Could you give Daisy this letter for me? And come back soon. I'll get my jog on. Jogging, running, the race. Oh, I'll never make it. 
Um, be right back. Try not to spiral out of control. Spirals, loops, laps, the race. Oh. <laughs> Need to find Daisy again. Daisy. Had a rabbit once. And her name was Daisy. <laughs> Daisy, where was where was Daisy though? Not here. And yeah, every area has a different soundtrack here, which is beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Da, 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 da. I think it was in the area down there. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Wait, didn't I find also a snail I didn't talk to? Da, 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 da. But I also need to talk to the bat. I was about to say Batman. See me, you're leaving it pretty close. I don't know how you're going to finish <laughs> Breath of the Wild before. I'm not, Josh. Wrong stream. Wrong. Wrong stream. All right, Tov. Here's a bunch of samples. <gasps> Splendid. I will reward and motivate uh, you with a mushroom fact. Mushrooms are from the kingdom of fungi. Is that where you came from? Come from? <laughs> I wish. No, it's a way of organizing them. Yeast is also a fungus. When you bake the bread, the yeast eats the sugar and the dough and makes gas with it. That's what makes bread airy and bubbly. Isn't that amazing? I guess. Re record scratch. <laughs> Wait, I also have this one here. Oh no, that was the wrong one. Sorry, give me a second. This one. <laughs> Don't worry. This next batch of mushrooms is quite exciting. <laughs> the wrong one <laughs> can you look for the red cage this one is really striking it looks like a well a red cage and has all these flies around it and smells really really bad let's say santa gives you zelda now would you stream it i would give it a try yeah i would give it a try but i'm not sure if people would watch um i, I did the same with Zelda linked to the past and um, I remember a lot of people didn't tune in because they were like, I don't want to get spoilered. You know? I've already looked around this one, but it's not in Syria. Do you think you'll be alright with that? Um, yeah, no problem. See you later. But we need to talk to you again. I came here with a purpose. Oh, do you tell? I'm on a quest. A love quest. Sorry, Scott, you're too young for me. <laughs> It's not for me. It's for somebody else. You're friends with Donna, right? Correcta mundo. We're both roaming collectors of swords. Well, I'm trying to help out Donna's secret admirer. Haley heard something about a love spoon that Donna is interested in. Do you happen to know anything about that? Yes, I know about it. Okay, great. Uh, could you write down some info about it for Haley? Nope. I don't have arms. I, but you can write it down on my behalf. Y you got a pen? What kind of male scout would I be if I didn't have one? It's okay. I already believe your cover story. But I'm really a scout. And that's exactly why I believe. <laughs> Ready yet? Oh, uh, yeah. Go go ahead. <clears throat> the love spoon is a miraculous thing, Josh. To scoop your stew as stalling sing... And to taste each scoop with new, a love anew, quite the conundrum indeed. From the spoon your love once gave to you, that's it. Well, I'm sure this will make sense at some point. Could you also just ask Donna what she wants? I never met Donna. <laughs> Is that the love spoon? You can ask him. I'm always amazed with your connections to Santa and the Easter, Easter Bunny, actually. <laughs> Doc, you are way too generous with me. Way too generous. I just wanted to say that. I suppose so. I'll just have to be very sneaky not to reveal anything. I'm sure it's nothing a mostly qualified male scout can't handle. See you around, Tav. Okay. Da -da 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 -da. I want to get high ground here because it feels like I missed a lot here. I got distracted by the forest. Da, 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 da. Da, 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 da. But 
this is again the forest. It's a small area. Maybe I should go back. Where's the frog go? Da 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 da. Uh oh. <gasps> oh no, I'm not stuck. Oh god. Mm -hmm. Oh, potion. I love potion. Explore a patch. Woohoo! Woohoo! Oh, wow, wow, wow. This is Mr. Rat. Teen T Rat. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. Da da da. Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> what is this in English? It's in German it's called fingerhood, like a finger hat. Da, 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 da. I'd like to support you. You're so kind. Thank you for all the support. Thank you so much. What do you think there would be if Mr. Frog here or Mrs. Frog? Somewhere? It's looking like climbable. A thimble? Oh, I never heard of that word. Thimble. I like the German word a bit more. Fingerhut. A finger hat. <laughs> there is an amethyst or something. Very shiny. Now the... Oh! I got, I think I got a badge for flying. Now how to get up there? Maybe this is, oh, this is the way. Oh, I just booped my head there. Oh, this is hard to control. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna get there though. There you go. Yep, I got it. Uh, no, I don't want to go to the home screen. Obsidian... Oh, no, it was not amethyst. Obsidian crystal. Obsidian is actually not a crystal, but it is pretty. So I'll let it slide. <laughs> so somebody is collecting those crystals. Uh huh. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Wow, I, I flew here and I was expecting to get something. Da 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 I need to find other characters and also these guys back. That's gonna be troublesome. Oi! Boink. Da, 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 da. This is where Daisy lives, right? <laughs> All the vegetables. Da, 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 da. I like the accordion. Actually, accordion is such a nice instrument. There are not many people who are actually able to play this instrument. Oh, Jazzy. Some thick carrots. Oh, we I think we found the characters here. Hey Ru, hi Daisy. There you are, the final competitor. You have a you have a letter from Shelby. Oh no, we need to go back to Shelby at some point. There's a rumor that Nintendo will release a Switch too. Yeah, I think uh, they're gonna do this uh, this summer. It's a bit too late, it feels like. They should do this with uh, the new Zelda. Maybe we get 60 FPS. <laughs> I like how this is just a running gag here. Welcome back, Des. How is she? She's so excited about the race. Aw, always love getting sharp notes. Bless my soul, the poor thing has worked themselves into a tizzy worse running. 
didn't know she was so worried about the race. Yeah, she, they, they seem pretty stressed. I think she sees me as some kind of idol. I have been waiting like three years for a new Switch. I'll take 59 FPS. <laughs> the thing is, since I'm not playing Switch Sports anymore, because I got all the skins or um, outfits, before that I was actually even rarely uh, touching my, my Switch. I played a bit of uh, Story of Seasons, yeah. But they're also available for the Steam Deck. I mean, you were Steam. Uh, <laughs> I am pretty much always using my, my Steam Deck. That is making my Switch very much non-existent, but I'm also not playing many Nintendo games. I think she sees me as some kind of idol. Steam Deck over... Yeah. Yeah. Steam Deck is amazing. Absolutely amazing. I was always hoping the, the Switch um, is gonna gonna get a nice firmware at some point where you're gonna get lots of updates but nintendo is very stubborn but soon fi fantasy life yes but there is no there is no date yet that's oh yeah I'm, i need that game the steam deck isn't enough for me I need more specs um there are i think asos is also bringing a, a deck soon a portable version definitely more battery highly depends on the game I'm playing Roots of Pacha, it's holding four hours, to be honest. But yeah, with bigger games, one and a half hour down, that's not much. Then you definitely need the charger. But uh, honestly, the Steam Deck changed my gaming life a lot. I can just chill in bed and play, that's super nice. I can just play when I'm outside. But it's big, it's also big. The screen is big. I think she sees me as some kind of idol. That I'm some kind of natural. But growing up, I was the slowest. All 12 siblings were faster than me. Wow, you got so many siblings? Wow. When I came here, I managed to find the fun in running again. Hope she'll be able to do that soon as well. Here, let me pan a quick response. <laughs> Could you give this to Shelby, please? I don't want this tearing her, uh, her up a moment longer. No problem, Miss D. We're also having another quest. Oh, Mimi. Can we have a little chat? Sure, what's up? I've seen you running around in town. I know some of my kids take a shine to you. Yeah, your kids are really cool. Good job birthing them. <laughs> Thanks. Well, I was wondering. My kids never show me their drawings anymore. I think they might be embarrassed. Or maybe they think I won't like them. But I miss looking at their drawings. Words can't express how proud I am of them. If you happen to get any of their drawings... Please, could you give them to me? I think I've got the, the 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 cat one, right? I'm playing every game 4K, 167 FPS. I need more batteries. <laughs> 4K gaming, what's that? <laughs> um, I'm very far away. I can't I can't get this with my my PC here. Would be nice, but yeah, 4K is very far away from me. Yeah, we'll see. Maybe end of the year, I can I can afford a new PC, but. It is how it is. Rich streamer with a steam. I'm not rich. I'm not yeah, rich now. I can only play on my PS5. And four. D don't you have the 3090 Ti? Damn. So the newest generation is, is going to be <laughs> better, I guess. That's crazy. That's crazy. Could you give them to me? Daisy, this is the cutest thing I've ever heard. And as a matter of fact, I have a drawing for you right here. <gasps> Look, it's a coin! Isn't this that coin Kiki has? I'm not sure, did Sarah draw this? Yup. She got that special coin from Kiki to start a collection. Oh, how kind! And uh, yeah, we're not gonna tell the story here. I don't have any games that support 4K. Um, I'm also thinking, I actually never thought about that, but... Isn't Horizon? Can't you, can't you play Horizon 4K? I'm not sure. I'm glad Setter has someone to share a coin passion with. We should invite Kiki over for tea sometime as a thank you. Uh, thanks so much for bringing this drawing to me. I'm going to pin it up right away. Please bring any other drawings you find on your way. I will. Da -da -da. Have a note from your smitten squirrel. 
Oh, you came all the way from the village. Bless you, honey bun. Snoop comes. I was wondering, for no particular reason, of course, which of these gift daddies would you want most? Oh, he's still so dedicated to impressing me year after year. Oh, he's gone and tied himself in knots over something that could be so simple. Don't forget, any and Egbert having their anniversary. There must be something on this mind. He told me not to tell you. Oh, malarkey. Tell you why. You tell me what's going through his mind, and I'll give you one of my tired and tested pasty techniques. It's kind of against our code. But it would help Egbert out in the long run. And helping it is the male scout coat. So deal. Deal. So it's nothing that juicy, sadly. Apparently, Clearance has been bothering him by being noisy and such. Oh, I could have guessed. Egbert always gets so irritable when he's got something on his mind. You want to know what always calms the bad boy right down? I'm listening. That cool, intimidating, the tough man loves wood carving. With the wood, wood picker. Could help out me. Uh, help, could help out. I bet Clarence would know where to find some good wood. They must be able to see everything from up there. So what if Clarence were to give Egbert a nice piece of wood to carve? Would to take his mind off things. Oh, and what a lovely gift a handcrafted labor of love would make. They just say that was a hint. <laughs> I think I've got it all. Wait, what was it again? I'll let me write it down for you, hon. Just deliver this note to Clarence. Aye, aye, Gram Gram. <laughs> aye, aye, Captain. Ba -ba -da -da. Da -da -da -da. Mm -hmm. Do you think there's something behind the waterfall? <gasps> there is something behind the waterfall. What a magical world! <laughs> Shroom plants and how not to kill them. Oh, wow! There is not just a secret, I don't know, a, a chest? No, it's a whole new world here! Da, 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 da. <gasps> oh my god, he's an artist! <gasps> it's Cass! My, my, my. That outfit. Um, what's with my outfit? It's ingenious. I bought, I brought steam to the kit. <laughs> I see. <laughs> Wait, I can't play Hogwarts in 4K. I, you could, yeah. You could, but you just finished this game. Do you really want to do this again? No, right? Such a bold use of color. Oh, it's because it's a fashionista. That hair color with your hat, parfait. Thank you. I, I chose it myself. Well, you must tell me one day. The name's Cass. My name is Mimi. Uh, remember, we're n we've never been met before. Uh, what now? The super secret passcode. Oh, yeah, sure. Hello, fellow super spy. How is work progressing? Irene has sent me with a letter and wants a status report. Oh, mon dieu. My dear, it is not progressing in the slightest, I fear. What do I say? That you're done with the work? No, no, no. I could never outright the light to the commander. Oh, but you seem to have been uh, quite busy. It's all trash. Trash, I tell you. Nothing, uh, Borsi. Nothing perfect. Perfect? What does it have to be perfect? Uh, 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 what? It's just a work in progress, right? A sketch isn't immediately a finished piece. Uh, well, I guess I do have more than uh, enough sketches. See, that's not nothing. I'm pretty sure that's what we in the the bit in the biz call something. All right, fine. You can show the sketch to uh, Arin, but please assure her the final product uh, surely won't be like uh, uh, that. Don't don't worry. I'll be sure to remind her. I shudder at the thought of her judging eyes. Quick, get that shoddy illustration out of my sight this instant. Cascade, okay? Da -da -da. Uh, what happened to my camera? Oh, what? I don't have the quest anymore. It's a bit buggy there, by the way. Just a bit, though. 
I need to find for a froggo. Look at those pictures. It's so nice looking. I like the melody here as well. So that was behind the waterfall. Mushroom sample for Tov. The blue pink gill might be the brightest mushroom I've ever seen. We're still missing Furoko. All right. So what was again on the other side? The think I think this is where we started, Kanda. I found Mr. Snail. Mr. Snail? And I found a lens. <laughs> Somebody lost their glasses. Oh, God. I'm sure this could work as a telescope lens, right? For Snowdrop. Oh. <laughs> Players are reminded to stay hydrated. All right, chat. Please stay hydrated. I'm also going to drink something. Hello. What are you doing here? It's not a frog, it's a snail. And I was searching for a frog. This is why I was in the, in the swamp. Hi. I am delivering mail. Oh, that sounds fun. Oh, uh, my name's Donna. What is your name? A Mimi. Oh, it's great meeting you, Mimi. What can I do for you today? Hello, Donna. I have a suspicious question. Oh, Lordy. I'm not interested in illegal entanglements. Currently, sorry. Currently, though, currently. Maybe someone else can help. No, it's not anything strange. But you are the only one who can help. Um, perchance? Asking for a friend. Ah, oh, sure, sure. If someone were to give you a gift in order to woo you... I mean, if someone were to ask you out with a gift, what would be... Scout, I'm sorry. I'm gonna have to stop you right there. Uh, the thing is... I, I really don't want to have to say this to you, but... Sorry, I'm just not re romantically interested in you. It's not for me. It's for Haley. <gasps> oh, sh we just said it. Big oops. Hmm. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to say. That's okay, I'm glad to know she's finally making a move. You like her back? Of course. Haley is the sweetest little thing I've ever I ever did meet. Because she's a goose, I'm also in love with her. It's clear we both like each other, but lordy lord, we've been going at a snail's pace. So, she wanted to know what gift I would like, huh? Yeah, the plan was to get you a love spoon. Oh, lordy. I brought up the love spoon because I'm going to give her one. <laughs> Scout, may I please ask you for your services? Could you deliver this love spoon to Haley? Nothing would make me happier. Fantastic, no need to check in with me after you've delivered it. From here on, we can manage it on your on our own. I think you're a good one, Mimi. Thanks for helping out. This is a love spoon. <laughs> what can he do with a love spoon, though? Just showing off. There are probably more things, items here, but I need high ground. But now I think I, I also think I've got the overview now. The better overview. Um what? Um whoa! It well? I wonder if it echoes. Echo! Oh wait, wait a second. I can actually do this as well. No, I don't. No, I don't have it here. Echo, echo. <laughs> echo, echo. You shouldn't be here. Um, what? What? Hiya! Who is this? Ribbit. It's a frog? 
Are you a froggy? You can talk, right? Ribbiting is talking. Oops, I mean, ribbit, ribbit. Who are you? Names are irrelevant. Think of me as he who controls the worms. Ribbit. Do you want to hear a secret? Okay, funny wild voice. Tell me your very legitimate total real secret. Did you know socks and antenna aren't real? It's a replica glued into their... <laughs> onto their hat. Um, the real one fell off in a skiing accident. That's some niche knowledge. How did you know that? The worms whisper their secrets to me. Ribbit. Cool. Tell the worms I said hi. Will do. Nice. Okay, well, bye-bye, boys. Ribbit. Okay, so there is a frog living inside of the well. <laughs> uh, we need to go back to the woodpecker, right? And the woodpecker was inside the forest. Da -da -da -da. Da -da -da. Oi! Oh! Echo, echo. But we also need to talk to the weasel. Dun, 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 dun. Hero. Reporting back after my long and arduous journey. Ah, uh, recruit, you made it. How'd it go? Um, it took a bit of convincing, but I've returned with a progress report. You managed to get your hands on one of the, his sketches? A rare sight. We're talking about uh, the, the artist bird, the French one. You must truly have a way with words. Or some quick fingers. <laughs> Maybe quick finger. He took some convincing. And he told me to give you a disclaimer. Oh, mon dieu. It is a but a sketch and not representative of the final work. Something like that. <laughs> like I was back in that cave for a second. Final work, this masterpiece, masterpiece that. I don't think I've ever seen those elusive finished pieces he talks about. I knew it was risky working with him. But I wanted to give him the benefit of the doubt. I do kind of want to see one of those masterpieces of flaw. Must really be something the way he talks about. You think so? I hope so. At least I have one reliable confidant. Confident? Swamp? No, I meant you! Uh, I still don't know what to do with Swamp. He's eager to help. I know, I just don't know what to assign him to. One piece of advice. Working with friends is difficult. Maybe that's why Janet's like that. She's just, she just likes me so much. I'm sure that's what it is. <laughs> Anyways, could you go deliver this to Swamp? There's a little typo here. I should at least keep him updated with our current progress. Aye, aye, boss. Sounds team, you played a Pokemon game. I am trying to uh, <laughs> to make my horizon a bit bigger, I guess. Da, 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 da. Oh, uh, oh, oh, <gasps> no, Mimi. Da, 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 I got a task for you. What's that crack a lacking? You ever got you ever going to run out of opening lines? Maybe. No promises. What have you been up to? You first. Right. Is you say a boss been jamming and packing? Slamming my head into some wood? <laughs> I really dig wood, like the tree can. Dude, Zazu's also doing this uh, woodpecker sound at some point. Did you like it? Uh, which game are we exactly talking about? Because I tried quite a few of them. How do you dig wood? Um, dig as in like... Yeah, basically, I love woodpecking. Like shaping wood with my beak. Face first. What are we talking about again? A letter, yes. Ta-da! Here it is. From Annie. You really took this uh, scenic route, huh? Oh, well, let's see here. Eggbird likes wood carving. Shh. 
Yeah, say it louder for the critters at the back. Stream, can you carry me in Tam Tam now? <laughs> the game with the battle pass? Mm. <laughs> Not sure. Monster Sanctuary. I haven't played this one for long, to be honest. Just a couple of minutes so far. So I can't give... Uh, I, I can't say much about this right now. Oops, sorry. But that's wild. He digs wood too? Epic. Oh, Scout, hold on. But the battle pass is a good clock. <laughs> I never bought battle passes and I never will, I think. Looked at your wish list and saw that you played it, but it was not on my wish list, right? No. Mm -mm. What? I'm having a power thought. I know just the thing for wood carving. There is an apple tree around here. It has the best wood. See if you can grab some sticks from near it and bring it back here. I think I found that one. Scout! There you are! It's a me! It is Mimi. And what's more, I got the goods. Or should I say, woods? Mm. See, I can't tell that it's funny. But somehow I don't feel like laughing. Oh. They can't all be singers, Paul. It's just how it goes sometimes. I suppose. Well, anyway, here it is. But let's take a good look at this tiny timber. Soft enough to carve, hard enough to hold small details, even wood grain. Yep, this is a top-notch lock right here. Really? Yup. Egbert's gonna dig this unlike anything he has ever dug before. Better bring it him to him quick then. Time to put paddle to the metal. I have no paddles nor metals. Oh well, then delivering this wood will have to do. Good luck, little buddy. Arigato. Okay, Egbert, you were here somewhere. Because you were f uh, filing a complaint. There you go. But in my feet... Oh, I, I, I assume so, yeah. Well, I think maybe we could... Uh, would like Temtem. It was looking good. I actually wanted to, wanted to be playtester. I had some playtesting codes, but the servers were down back then. That was unfortunate. I actually had even two or three or four or five. I can't remember. I had quite a few, but they were, yeah, the servers were down. Did you get work? Uh, no. Did you get word from Annie? What did she say? Did she reveal what she wanted? Oh, and I hope I wasn't too obvious. Don't you think Annie might appreciate something handmade? A labor of love, if you will. Oh, lordy lord. I hadn't even thought about that yet. No, what do you think? I'm lazy if I just buy her something. I think she doesn't mind at all. She's lovely, isn't she? Isn't she lovely? I'm a lucky man. She's stuck with me this long. <laughs> you know, on my way back, I was taking a stroll through the woods and found this beautiful piece of wood. Clarence said it'd be perfect for wood carving. Ha! <laughs> sure. What would Clarence know about wood carving? Well, he's a woodpecker. They're actually quite the avid woodworker themselves. I'll be the judge of that. Hand it over. Soft and supple enough to carve. Hard enough to hold small details. A fine and even wood grain. Oh, it's gorgeous. Clarence really knows their wood, huh? It's too pretty, though. I, I don't know if my old hands would do it any good. Do you think this could make a good anniversary gift? I think you'd make a wonderful anniversary gift out of it. No matter the craftsmanship or technique. Yuki will always show through. I think I know what I want to make for Annie. Thanks for your help, Mimi. Before I leave you to it, any chance you know where I could find Greg? Oh yeah, that was that was the very first quest. Who is Greg? Where is he? Now that's a name you don't hear a lot nowadays. Do you know Greg? A real old time of the forest. I haven't seen the old slug around a bit. Maybe that's the frog inside the well. He usually comes and goes as he pleases. Don't know where to point you with any more certainty than I guess. Well, then I keep asking around. I'll do, uh, deliver this letter eventually. I'm sure you will. All right, done. We need to talk to Miss Goose. If it isn't Mimi, I was worried you'd left me to struggle with this all alone. What took you so long? Don't worry about it. I have two things for you. The first one is your official advice letter, co-authored by Hammond Top. 
Oh, let me have a look. Boombox serenade running through the rain. Taste each scoop of love. What in the knickknack paddywhack is this all supposed to mean? Neither of them really helped me figure out how to get it lost before Donna. Oh, what a mess I'm in now. Have you forgotten something? Uh, what? Oh, yeah, you have another thing laid on me. Here it is, your very own love spoon. You found, a, you found a love spoon? Amazing! Where did you get this? You might want to sit down for this one. No, I was born to stand. <laughs> Lay it on me, Scouty. Well, Donna gave it to me to give it to you. Uh, is she... So she likes me back? Without a doubt, she said so herself. Oh, heavens, what a lucky goose I'm today. Thank you for bringing this wonderful news to me. No problem. <laughs> but if you want to thank anybody, you should thank whoever sent me your way. Great idea. Can you please give this note to whoever sent the first letter? It would be my pleasure. Who is it? Who is it? Secret admirer patch. Okay. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. We need to find... We need to go back again. Who was the rabbit with the glasses? Oh, that was the lens guy, right? Yeah, the lens guy. What a nice name. Bum, bum, ba, da, da, da. Da, 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 da. I like your backpack. Do you have any special stuff in there? <laughs> yes, the most special stuff, actually. I've got some top secret items in here. Oh, can I see? No, oh, sorry, that, that would be breach of privacy. But I'll have you know, I'm the gnome trusted with delivering these documents safely. Wow. So you're a spy? Nope, I'm a male scout. Be sure you're a good cover story. <laughs> Da, da, da. Mm -hmm. Is that the telescope guy then? Yes. I got your lens. I found them. Da, da, da. It's probably just the beginning of the quest. Hey, Ro, check it out, Snowdrop. Do you think this lens would fit? Oh, that looks perfect. My gosh, the telescope works again. Thank you so, so, so much. I have to go to sleep right now. Uh, why? It's daytime, which means the stars are sleeping. If I sleep now, I'll be wide awake later when the stars are awake too. Oh, one more thing. Here's a drawing I made as a thank you. I hope you like it. <laughs> Your mom is gonna like that. Oh, that's so sweet. Thank you, Snowdrop. <laughs> Snowdrop? She well as she fell asleep standing up. Talent. Sleep tight, Snowdrop. The stars will be happy to see you again tonight. <laughs> so cute. Now we're going to Mr. Turtle. Preparing for the rally. I mean race. Hey there, speedy shelps. Back, back, back again. Oh, hi there, Mimi. Sorry, I've been feeling a bit down. Please tell me you have some good news from Daisy. Here's her letter. She was really worried about you. You shouldn't push yourself so hard. Being fast isn't all there is to life. You should run to have fun. You're enough just as you are. This is almighty kind, but... I just don't see the point anymore. I think I'm gonna throw in the towel. There's no way I'll win that race anyway. Uh, hang on. There's another letter in here. It's a blank page? Oh wait, it says something here. Could I please have the autograph of the first turtle track star ever? Ah, No, I'm gonna cry. Well, sign it first before you cry. I can't deliver a soggy autograph to Daisy. Don't worry, Scout. I'll deliver it. I delivered this one. That way I can get some extra training in. Thanks for sticking around when I got the sads. Of course, no one should be sad alone. Does that mean it's the end of the sads? Hopefully, Scout. Hopefully. 
Take care, little scout. Run fast. You too, shall we? Oh, wait. One last thing. Now that your brain is out of sport mode, have you got any idea where Greg might be? Oh, that's the one you were asking about earlier, right? I've had a good old thinky think since then. Thinky think. To no avail, sadly. I vaguely remember hearing about a Greg some years back. But where they are now, no clue. Sorry I couldn't be of more help, little scout. It's okay, it was worth asking. Hmm. But, I think every time we were having uh, a quest line finished, we're getting more information. Well, that's actually a road here. Wink. But I was not here so far. Oh, maybe a little secret secret. I got a secret. <gasps> There's a potion hidden. Do, 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 do. Also reminds me a bit of short hike. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -hmm -hmm -hmm. I need to go back to Toph. The Scarlet Elf Cup has a terrible name. There were no elves around. So, where is Greg? I bet it's the, the frog inside of the well. What is this rope? Another love spoon or what? <laughs> Uh, that's the forest. You're right with the short hike, yeah. But uh, just in 3D here. There's another potion. Secret, secret. Yoink. Da, 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 da. But we didn't have to talk to you anymore. Nope. It wasn't you. Mm -hmm. Oh! I found something. First of all, mushroom sample. That purple pinwheel mushroom really stands out against those yellow flowers around. Lemon 8 bottle cap. Lemon drinks are simply the best. I don't have to find the others. <laughs> da, 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 da. All right. Mm -hmm. All right, Daisy. There you go. Hey, yeah, Mimi. Have you got a second drawing for me? Mm -hmm. Sure do. Why, it's the stars. Ah, oh, it's so beautiful. These stars are all in the right spots too. Let me guess, did Snowdrop draw this? Sure she did. What a great kid she is. Not the most social, but very, very passionate. Thanks so much for bringing it to me. This one is getting pinned up right next to the first. Please stop by if you get another. I will. Whoa, who's that male scouty I see? Could it... Oh, wait, her voice was like this. Could it be Cupid themselves? You have one to talk, Gram Gram? None of this would have happened without your mendling. Oh, well, I can't stand by and watch young love flounder. I met Egbert when I went looking for the nut that buried a nut on my property. And look at us now. So no matter if it starts with something small or a grand gesture, now that those two have made the first step, uh, it'll figure itself out. If I didn't know you, you better, I'd... If I didn't know you better, I'd say you're pretty wise, Gram Gram. I'm plenty wise, you little rapscallion. <laughs> well, since you're so wise, do you know where Greg is? <gasps> Greg! Oh, my stars, I forgot all about him. 
He's a bit of an elusive figure around here. He has a nice spot up out of the valley and the ridge. I guess it's so nice that he doesn't often come down. <laughs> oh, I know. Jim hangs around there quite a bit too. Who's Jim? That's definitely a frog now. He's a bit of a funny guy. Never seen much either. Sometimes you can hear his voice on the waterfall. He stays around the pond up there all alone. If you find Jim, I'm sure he'll help you find Greg too. I'll go check it out. Thanks for the help. And you, thanks for your help. Are we both helpful today, huh? <laughs> Jim. Aha. Uh -huh. Jim. Who's Jim? Jimmy. Ba -da -da. Da -da 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 -da. By the waterfall, they said. But I'm gonna go to the Red Sea first. All right, Red Sea, we have to talk. Beep, beep, delivery for Swamp with an A. That's not you, right? Well, I guess I can't deliver it then. No, 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 gimme, gimme. Who is it from? Is it, you know, Intel? Of the secret variety? Ding, 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 we've got a winner. Irene wanted to give you a progress update. A sketch from Cass? How'd you get this? Intimidation? Threatening shiny trinkets with some boom booms? Some kind words never hurt anyone. Is Cass in need of some cheering? There in luck, I'm his biggest fan. I don't know the first thing about art. By the way, look how big the rat is. <laughs> I just know that his colors always make me feel a bit happy inside. They are very happy. I mean, pretty. <laughs> like looking up at the twinkling stars. Oh, you, you talk just like them. Like a poem. I don't understand him half of the time, but I should visit them again sometime. Sadly, I'm not allowed to leave my post. Whatever shall I do? Yeah, write a letter. A red. It's a cute one. The nose is a bit crooked. <laughs> you can write, right? You can deliver mail, correct? You can deliver mail? Whoa, you come up with the most creative solutions. Well, could you go deliver this to Kaz? On this game from yes to no, how secret is this intel? Huh? Oh, never mind. Got a blast. Oh, blasting that I understand. Blast away. Okay, let's go to Cass. Why TNT? He just loves TNT. Maybe because he's underground anyway and then he's just exploding his way through. <laughs> da 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 da. This didn't work. Oh, this is such a beautiful game. I like it a lot. <laughs> but where's Jim? Oh, Jimmy? Jimmy McGill. No. nice to watch i'm glad i'm glad that you're also liking it mon dieu back so soon oh no 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 i have not a lick of work to show this time over my cold feathers uh, will i show another sketch i get goosebumps uh, from the word wouldn't wouldn't that be crow bumps <gasps> crow oh, i'm not just a crow but a raven Behold my raven black feathers, not mere crow black. Uh, I mean, beside all the paint, they are surely black. Anywho, I come from the swamps? Explains the smell. Unnecessary. Well, you smell like paint. I do? What happened to my light vanilla aroma with a touch of rose and lavender? Long gone. Anyway, I have a letter from swamp, from the swamps. He can write... Uh, you expect him to draw you a picture? Well, he has before. Uh, 
I still have them hanging on my wall. Oh, they are so pure and intuitive. I wish I could grasp some of that curiosity. The colors uh, always make me feel a bit happy inside. Uh, did you help him write this? Uh, that he wrote himself. Oh, mon petit junior red. <gasps> the color also makes me happy inside. Then why not just paint the colors? A masterpiece can come second. <gasps> I think I would like to try that. Well, it surely ain't a masterpiece, but I don't think it has to be. That's the spirit. You shouldn't trot along and show it here in before I get the doubts. I think in the meantime I might go paint some more cooler. Okie dokie. Smell ya later. Hey! <laughs> hey! It's very chill. It's also very chill for me. I'm glad. Makes me happy to hear. Then it was a good choice to, to play this game tonight. An empty shack. The best forgery I've ever seen. I mean, a total legit shack. Irene was the weasel, right? Okay. I hope I will find the weasel again. Same with the band. Ba -ba -ba -bum -ba -bum. Da -da 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 -da. I don't think there's a shortcut. Oh, maybe there is a shortcut if I can climb up here. But I think they were on the other side. No, they were in the forest, the weasel. Da -da 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 -da. Oh no, there's no way I can climb this up. Nah. It's okay. Wait, can I get stuck here or is there a secret? Oh, never mind. I thought there's gonna be a secret. It's looking like a perfect place for that. Was the bat also living here? Da, 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 da. Yep. Hey, bro. Oh, we have to talk. Ah, I can smell it already. You've got some more mushroom samples. You sure have. Which means it's mushroom fact time. Not again. Did you know that fungi can form underground root networks with each other? That's actually super impressive, yeah. So when you're walking through the forest and you see mushroom, that mushroom knew you were coming because the root network told it about you. You're just so cool. Uh, I don't like that fact very much. I think it's very impressive. Can I go? You can go. Look for more. The scarlet elf cup looks like a pink cup with red on the inside. It likes to grow in the shaded spots, so maybe look around between rocks or between lots of plants. They can really stand out against all of the green of plants. The parrot vex cap is a green mushroom that likes to grow in bunches. It's known to be a bit small and slimy. Apparently it likes high places near moving water. The, blunk, the blue pink gill, despite its confusing name, it's... Ah, oh, this is just a repetition of everything, right? Very impressive with the French accent. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I actually don't even know if it's poisonous or not, so I'm excited to find out. Oh god, a little typo here as well, but that's okay. The wrinkled peach, well, it looks a bit like a wrinkly peach, it likes to grow near lots of colorful flowers. There's the gold tuft, a yellow mushroom. For lack of a better word, I'd say it looks hairy and bumpy. They're usually on humid places and growing on wood. Come on, Scout, go out and find those rooms. Um, I still need to find them, I guess. I got more samples. Terrific. You've also unlocked another mushroom fact. Oh, please no. So far, they've only made me queasy. This one, not so bad, I promise. Okay, then. There's a type of mushroom that can control your mind. <laughs> um, Cordyceps mushrooms can infect an insect's body. And control them to climb to the top of a tree. And literally throw them down there. Yeah, I know that one. Isn't that just magnificent? Are we done here? I have to go cry and or scream. It's only natural when you just like the turning of tides. You can't fight the waves. 
Neither can you fight the mind control mushrooms. I am not comforted by this. That's okay. None of the ones on my list should have these effects. Should? Could it be? Yep, more samples. But please don't give me another mushroom fact. Mushroom fact time! Did you know that there's a type of honey fungus that spreads across the whole mountain? It's the biggest living thing that we can see. That we can see? Yup. Huh. Tough. What's the matter? I can't find the three mushrooms you were talking about. Can you just grab... Mm, okay. I'm still missing. The red cage. This one really striking. Red cage and Hannah flies around and smells really bad. Not in this area. Green mushroom that likes to grow in bunches. It's on to be a bit sm small and slimy. It likes high places near moving water. A yellow mushroom. Hairy bumpy. Humid places and grown wood. Okay. Well, this is humid, right? But I didn't see the mushroom. Is it going to be mushroom like that? I'm going to go to Mr. Weasel. Da, 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 da. Wait, I found the mushroom. No, that's not mushroom. That's TNT. <laughs> <laughs> Super jump. Yeah, I feel like a bit mercy. Like mercy. Where's the weasel? What's on the rock? Yes, over there. At the beginning, it's very overwhelming with the world, but it's not that big. Hello. Ta da! Shh. What's this? A masterpiece from Kaz? I assume it's up to your standards in that case. It's better than I dared hope. How did you. I think you should promote Swamp to Team Masket. I really managed to lift some spirits. Oh, I knew those two got along. I should have let them work together. I was scared Spomb would distract Cass. Maybe not everyone is as self-reliant as me. No need to be self-reliant with friends like these. They want to make this work just as badly as you. Even if they weren't as sure how to get about, how to go about it as you. By the way, all this very non-secret into what's it all for? You're not liable if you are not aware. I'm not sure that's how the law works. That's okay. I avoid working with the law. With what? How strict is your relationship with the law? I always take a sip from Janet's drink when she makes me get it for her. Oh, you're a real scoundrel. <laughs> what am I doing? <laughs> we need the same backpack for you. <laughs> it's very cute, right? With the acorn. It's very sweet. How do you feel about male-related crimes? The worst kind? Worse than stealing a sip? Yeah, probably. Worse than being greedy? Is stealing a sip greedy? Maybe a bit unsanitary, but it's for survival? Yeah, then greed is probably worse. What were we talking about again? Swamp Kaz and I have made a letter for that cat. He's a very greedy cat. And we thought we should lighten his pockets a little. <gasps> Irene! Just because he's a bad cat, that doesn't mean we can't just join. Coins. Can we chant? Like stealing? Shh. Let's say we're taking a sip from his wallet. It's for survival and he's still got the whole cup. And he also made other people get his drink. He didn't make it himself. Oh. So if you could just deliver this letter to Kiki the cat real quick. That'd be grand. On it, boss. <gasps> I'm going to lose my job. I'm going to lose my job. Wow. Okay. <clears throat> Urgent delivery for Mr. Cat. From the bank of... Uh, bank of Gro Growfoot. Uh, gro a bank? Give me that. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, blah, 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 blah. Yada, yada, yada. Deposit waiting for me. 
You get a pen for me, kid? I'm a male, I'm a male scout actor. Whatever, whatever. Get a pen or not? I don't think so. Oh, of course. Let me check to be sure. Mm -hmm. Behold, a marvel of engineering, a stick of ink. Give me that. Name, banking number, check. Card expiration date. Uh. <laughs> check. Mother's maiden name. For his pet name? Okay, that should be... <laughs> Kiki! Make sure to get this back to the bank safely. It's an important deposit. A deposit to me is always top of priority. We just need to, the credit card number now. The security number. Uh, we'll do. Could I have my pen back? I never specified how long I'd be borrowing it. First rule of business, always read the fine print. But you said it out loud. There wasn't any fine print to read. Well, in that case, finders, keepers. Kiki, I don't like Kiki anymore. And I found this pen in my hand just now. Wow. Stolen from Janet anyway. Uh, deliver this back to the bank right away. You better no dilly-dallying on the clock. Make haste. Prime, crime prevention patch. Uh-huh. We're actually getting criminal now. I should feel bad, but he yoinked my pen. Which I yoinked. <laughs> Whatever crime you're committing to that cat, he deserves worse. Don't worry, we're hitting him where it hurts. Nothing he values more than his big self and his big capital. I think you should just hit him next time. <laughs> also be satisfied with a kick. But you got him to sign. Didn't take much convincing. He smelled money and basically stopped listening after that. <gasps> oh my god, Mimi, what are you seeing here? Not that he was listening before that anyway. Oh, you big time. Just so happens I recently came into some wealth, so let me know if you ever need anything. Ah, oh, don't worry, us male scouts get adequately compensated in friendship. And secret missions, of course. Speaking of reparation, I guess that's the mission official completed. Cool. I never completed a mission before. We should go deliver the good news. Could you please go deliver this letter to Kaz? And I think sh I should just go to talk to Swan myself. I want to just be his friend again. No more work. I'm sure he'd love to see you and hear all about your... Our operation. I'll go check on Cass. Good luck and have fun. All right, how to get there to Cass again? Where the, the water is running, flowing over there. I'm, I'm a criminal now, Chad. Oh my God, I'm part of the operation. I should feel bad. I'm feeling a bit bad, but he was very mean. But that doesn't mean I have, I'm having the right to yoink stuff. Oh, here. It's so cool that there is a secret uh, way to get to Kaz. Hello. Oh, bonjour, petit scout de mail. I, uh, what, what did you, uh, did you make that? <laughs> I did. It's wonderful, Cass. It smells like paint and touch of vanilla. And rose. A hint of lavender? Oh, you jest. Nothing to smell here but color, my friend. A veritable universe of use. I eat, uh, sleep, and breathe paint. Hey, buddy, take a few deep breaths. Wait, no, don't! I mean, maybe just put the paint tubes down for a second. I have a letter and some good news. I mean, called your work a masterpiece and Kikia ate it up. Not literally, don't worry. Your masterpiece is signed on its way to be cashed in. Well, not signed by you, sadly, but that's probably better. That'd be like signing your name under, well, something illegal. I don't care, it's not signed by me. If I've experienced a good death, my, my friend, I need no mortal possessions or esteem. I must simply create. Um, is it okay if I do a big spring cleaning in here then? No! Don't touch my shinies! 
Exactly. Uh, I think what you need is a nap. Maybe some water? Not paint water. <laughs> Mon dieu, a nap does actually sound very nice. Go count some sheep. No more worrying about work. The crating can also wait till tomorrow. You'll still be you, pure, intuitive, and wond wondrous. But then also with a clear mind. Oh, mon dieu, that monologue worked wonders. <gasps> Almost brought me to sleep. <laughs> wow, I can't believe you'd insult me like that, stinky crow. <laughs> oh, one last thing before you can get ready for a nap. Do you happen to know someone by the name of Greg? Uh, Greg as in Gregory? Uh, Mama, my, I almost forgot he was still around. He tends to keep uh, to himself, you see. He has a nice spot up on the ridge. Doesn't come down into the valley much. I do not... I do know that he's good friends with the gym, though. I don't mind Jim. He seems to be a fellow artist like myself. The same person in different forms, if you will. He's a bit elusive, but he's uh, usually up near the pond above the waterfall. Hope uh, that gives you a place to start looking. That's great, Cass. Thanks, Bundle. Near the pond? Oh, God. I'm not going to find Gregory. Huh? Da, 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 da. Wait, can I look into the quest here? I'm also missing so many batches still. It, it's seven deliveries I'm missing. Deliver meals instead of mail. Yeah, I'm missing two mushrooms. Deliver letter in under 30 Okay. <laughs> and I'm still missing eight trinkets. Ah. Oh, so what did they say? Oh, bonjour, petit scat de mail. Oh, yeah, they're just uh, repeating again, right? Mm -hmm. Kaz oh, wait, Kazma? I shouldn't know it was only fun the first time. Oh, well. Da -da -da -da. Mm -hmm. More shrooms for Zemni. Mm -hmm. You would love that. So where's Gregory? And where's Jim? The pond. There is a pond? I feel like I'm missing a complete new area. Can share this with Odelia. <laughs> she also doesn't like uh, mushrooms. Are we talking about this pond? Jim, are you here? It must be a frog. She hates them. <laughs> I've got the little fear that I'm not gonna find Jim. Oopsie. Oh my god, almost failed.
It's also gonna be hard to see from here because yeah, we got high ground, but I'm far away. And they said by a pond, but there is no water here. Where was this area with a picnic, by the way? I've I was there only once and never again. Oh, wait, what? <gasps> oh, no! I messed it up. I mean, where does the water start? Oh, this well. Are we talking about this well? No, they, they were talking about a pond. I'm so confused right now. Rack is lost. <laughs> and his friend Jimmy as well. I mean, Jim. <laughs> Jimmy. Hello? You still here, creepy wild voice? Yes, Ribbit. But I must tend to the worms. They call for me. Okay, then. Bye-bye, uh, Ribbit. Uh, Mr. Wild voice? Hello, Wormy. How are you? You trade the target on their daily runner? Mm-hmm, yes, mm-hmm. Quite interesting indeed, thank you. <laughs> I think that's Jim. Here's your compensation. Um, okay. What? No, that's not Jim. Oh, this is where the picnic is. <gasps> this area, the bamboo area, I was never there. Oh my god, there's a new area. I forgot about that. I saw it once and I was like, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna find this again. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. How can I cross now? By getting high ground. Oh, this goose is so cute. Oui. Bamboo area. Yeah, this is the way. Warmy. <laughs> Bamboo area. I think I collected everything here. At least I tried. The caterpillar. Oh, there are lots of worms here. <laughs> All right. Bamboo area. Oh, yeah, they were saying it has something to do with the waterfall. And there is probably a pond here, right? Mm -hmm. So it's going down. <laughs> Who is this? Hi! Hello! I'm a capybara! Oh my god, Zomnik, it's a capybara! Cool! Sure looks like it, but that's not all. Oh? I'm a sad capybara. No! 
What's what's got you feeling unhappy, Barra? My head. It's gone. <laughs> I feel complete without it. What does this hat of yours look like? It's round and orange and smells kind of like citrus. So it's a small orange? No, it's a hat. My hat. You are sure it's not an orange? Yeah, an orange is a fruit and this is a hat. But if it helps you to think of my hat as an orange, then you can consider it as an orange. But it's not an orange. It's a hat. Okay. Well, I'll go have a look for an orange-shaped hat. I'll let you know if I find anything. Thank you, thank you, thank you. If you need me, I'll be here having a nap. <laughs> so that I can at least wear my hat in my dreams. See you later. Okay. Well, let's try to find the hat. I think it's also not that much uh, of content anymore, so I kind of want to finish this. Orange. Oh. Is that shiny? I found some. I found an orange? Or what is it? Just an orange, normal orange on the small side could pass as a hat, maybe? <laughs> then it was super small. Then I have to wake you up again. I'm on a roll lately. Yeah, I would not go all in anymore, to be honest. Max! Mm. Are you awake? I, yeah, I'm now. What's up? What's up is your hat. Because it goes up on top of your hat. Get it? Because your hat is up. Ah, oh, never mind. Your hat. Ta-da! My hat! Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I'll never lose again. Lose it again. It is an easy hat to lose, I must admit. <laughs> With it being so similar to oranges. Uh-uh! You found my one, the one hat out of the billions of oranges. Obviously, it has distinct hat energy. She will chalk it up to that. And not my supreme searching skills. Thanks again, Mimi. Whenever I wear my hat, I'll think of you now. The highest honor. See ya, Max. See ya, Mimi. <laughs> Kitty. Very cute. I need high ground again. It was so small, but shiny. Oh. Slowly getting there. Oh, there's... Jo <gasps> I, found a, uh, I found a frog. Chat, I found a frog. Boink. <laughs> well, I was expecting I'm gonna fly high with that. Oh, <laughs> there is one uh, right next to me. The gold tuft is one of the very few fuzzy mushrooms. So cool. <laughs> okay, so we need to talk to Mr. Bad again. <laughs> what what's this? Something very shiny. Da, 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 da. All right. Hello. Are you Jim? It is Jim. I've been expecting you. Whoa, really? Then can you help me find Greg? Yes. Yes? Wait. No. Not again. Well, I could. I, I just thought... You were here to listen to my enchanting song. Maybe deliver me a recording contract? No, I'm really just here for Greg. Greg is my best be be bear friend, but he's always stealing the spotlight. He's a bear? What? You're the first one that's not surprised at the fact I have a friend. Nice. Well, where is he then? Should be easy to remember if he's your best friend. Well, he's just a hop, skip, and jump over yonder. For me, at least. For someone of your stature. It's how to put it more complicated? Is that a short joke? Rude. 
Well, no, it's just crack lives in a cave in a difficult to reach area. You need to quite some acrobat acrobatics to get up there. I'm not sure you're a real male scout. You have at least like what, 14 of those male scouts patches. So you seem qualified. Really? I think this is just a check mark to see if you already did enough, enough quests here. But I think we just passed it. Well, relatively. Relative to what? I don't know, a rock maybe? Just be sure to finish everything you want to do. After getting to Greg's place, you are probably leaving immediately. Meal card protocol and all. I'll be sure to finish up my deliveries then. When you're ready to just glide up with the air from the hot spring on my house. Just open it up so you should be able to glide across now. Oh, easy peasy. And then just find your way through the overground bush. You're going to ride away as long as you're going generally up. You see Greg's cave? It's pretty big. Less easy peasy. Is this gonna be bare, really? But I'm not peasable. <laughs> uh, oh, whoopsie. Um, I've got another quest though. Though. Um. Oh my god! No, no, no! I I'm gonna deliver this to the bat quick, and then we're gonna go. Quick, wait, what is this bubble? Maybe a raindrop. Ba 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 ba. But oof, where was he again? I'm thinking. <gasps> I found a secret! Oh, it's right here. I'm gonna mess it up, right? Oh, lo, lo, lo. <gasps> I made it! So where's this Batman? On the other side, right? Greg could be a bear, yeah? It's gonna be a cute bear, I think. Arrow, you're back. Have you got a sample for me? Look at what I was looking for. Could you repeat it? No problem. Oh, wait, we did this, but I'm still missing two of them, right? Because I got the golden one. Tob, what's the matter? Wait, I can't. I want to deliver this. I can't. Oh, I need to find all three. Oh, I don't want to do this right now. I bet I can't come back anyway to finish. I want to get 100%. Well, that was unfortunate. <laughs> then I need to get high ground again. Do you think I can climb this up? No. No. I did a detour. I want to see a big bear now. Maybe it's not even a bear. But I wonder what this wall is for. I bet gr that's Greg. He's just... Not often here. They said it. Sounds like a bear. <laughs> Maybe, yeah. Oh, this is not how we get high ground. The lily pads are a lie. Kid? Yes. Let's go. Oh. Oh my God. Where am I heading to? Here? 
This looks a bit odd, right? No. Dude, I can't see anything. <laughs> um, I'm... <gasps> I made... I thought I have to go here. Wait, what's this here? My eyes, it was very white. I'm sorry. <laughs> da, 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 da. Aha! Uh -huh. That looks interesting, huh? Oh, snowy! Wait, is this the cave we're talking about? I think so. Um, that's a bear. Wait a second. What's inside of this cave then? Well, somebody's definitely riding uh, Greg. Wait, what is this cave here? Dragon. <laughs> Hibernation, yeah, it's looking like that. Big bear. <gasps> Hello! Good night, Jared. Mr. Crack, have a letter for you. It's kind of important. Wake up! Do you think he's dead, B? <sniffs> you should poke him with a stick to check. Oh, God. <sniffs> <laughs> Look at the bee. <laughs> okay, okay, I won't poke the bear. <sniffs> what? You think he's gonna into hibernation? What's that? Oh, like a super nap. Mm, that's okay. We'll just wait for him to wake up. <laughs> um. mm -hmm. What? Well, for how long? Until spring? But then I can't deliver the letter today. Leave it here? Absolutely not. Someone else might take it. It's not the Mega Scout way. I don't want to go ask Janet for help. Fine, I'll do. I'll do. Janet's probably still at the van. <laughs> Little bear. Oh, I need to go down then. Oh. I thought Janet would be here. She was here when I left didn't seem to be intent on moving. What's that be? You can smell where Janet went? I don't know bees could smell. Aren't it times better than I can? Wow, alright. Sniff the way, Detective Bee. It's <laughs> cute. <gasps> Surprise! Oh, everyone is here. What? Congrats on your first completed assignment. Oh, um, that's so nice of you all. But, um, I'm sorry to disappoint. I didn't deliver the letter to Greg. I'm so sorry. But that's it? No, could I have a word, Mimi? I am so sorry, Janet. Please don't be mad. I am not mad at you. Why not? I failed. I, I can't come back from something like this. All of the scouts will think I'm a fraud. 
Sometimes we just kind of meant to fail and learn from it, you know? No, I, I don't know. I needed this delivery to go well. Why? What about all the other letters you've delivered by now? Don't think I, was, I wasn't keeping an eye on you. Because it was my assignment. I've got to complete my first assignment perfectly. What will happen if you fail it? Hmm. I don't know. Everyone will be disappointed in me. And think I'm not a real male scout. It'll ruin me. Does that mean I'm not a real male scout either? Uh, have you ever failed an assignment? Yeah, many times. One time I read the address wrong and it ended up at the North Pole. <laughs> really? Yeah, sometimes you mess up. Or sometimes something just can't be done with the way you wish it would be. It's totally fine to fail. It just happens occasional occasionally and we learn from it. But thanks, Janet. They make me feel better. No worries, Mimi. Now, how about you go enjoy this party we want put together for you? Come talk to me again when you're ready to skedaddle. Okay, Mrs. Boss. <laughs> well, okay. Hello? Anybody in there? Poor bun must be tuckered out from all the excitement. Sleep tight, little bun. <laughs> <laughs> they are having a party here. It's nice to see. Clarence! Hey, Clarence. Of a crying Clarence. Hey, the little scout. Don't mind me, I was just jamming. Thanks so much for your help earlier. You've returned Edward's frown upside down. It's nothing short of a miracle. Big party. Yeah, it's nice to see them here all. <laughs> They're all wiping. <laughs> you know, with the noise complaint and all, I figured you'd be into, I don't know, a cooler instrument? Scout, scout, scout. You are truly not yet wise to the way to the ways of the world but this triangle possesses unique raw musical power and i'm the it's to vessel to unleash it on the world you dig i i'm digging i think <laughs> don't worry let me get back to it and i'll show you what it's all about just listen and enjoy the party thanks again little friend <laughs> can i talk to frog or no it's a bit buggy. I can't talk. Oh, no. Hey, socks. <laughs> you good, socks? Let socks ask me me fair question. Socks look like socks. Want talk? Socks no spare leg to stand on. Bing bong music costs lots leg like energy. You don't need legs to chat, though. Me me thick skull? <laughs> thick skull. <laughs> Not chat time. Socks chase auditory glory. <laughs> wow, that's a long word for you, socks. Me me go to jail. Jail? In socks head. Me mean forever jail. Suffering daily. That's too bad. I'll be out then. I love your xylophone plink though. It sounds beautiful. Mm. Thank. <laughs> Swamp. A bomb bomb. How's life treating you? Oh, this is a bit buggy. Splendidly. As you can see, I'm reclining with mine, homies. I've got a bunch of the suns out. A rat could not want for more. That's good to hear. Things are winding down after the high spam. Thankfully, this hangout, it's been a long time coming. Thanks for making it happen, Mimi. That special spark you have inside that you used to help us, you're gonna help a lot of people with that spark. No, oh. <laughs> And maybe the spark can one day light a fuse. Oh no. And the fuse burns all the way up to boomstick. And then boom! <laughs> Explosion. Explosion indeed. <laughs> we just have to see what happens, I guess. A rat can dream. Take care, little scout. And don't be a stranger. Wouldn't dare swampy swoop. Swampy swoop to your mimi. Can I talk to... Jim. Jim, I want to talk to you. It's not possible. What about ham? <laughs> ham is jamming with blueberries and cheese. <laughs> Why, hula there, ham. Hula yourself, mimi. Yeah. Uh, what's with the face? I'm confused at how you were dancing that hard but are breathing so normally. Ah, it's all in the core strength, my dear scout. My extreme internal muscles are simply not allowing me to be out of breath. Determined, imit 
imitation of normal breathing, I call it. Or D-I-N-B for short. Also, now, no one can tell if I'm nervous when I'm din bing. Are you nervous, Han? A little. I'm not so good with people. Do you think I'm dancing too much? Am I making you fool out myself? Be honest. Nah, you're good. You're dancing exactly the right amount for you. Thanks, Mimi. Glad you think so. Well, I hate to dine and dash, but I have to stop talking now. The longer I spend talking, the less time I spend eating. <laughs> and time is calories, my friend. <laughs> I like him. You've got to replace the energy you use as soon as you use it. Or you're gonna run out. It's called replacing energy real time. Or R-E-R-T for speedy talking. I'm rorting. E eating and dancing? Truly jack of all trades. More like a ham of all. Of all. Shoot, I can't think of a rhyme again. That's okay. Save all the brain power for the rorting and dinbing. Right you are, right you are. Bye Mimi, it was nice to meet you. Likewise, have a lamb. <laughs> oh wow, look at those moves. Hi. Hi Mimi. Hi Ashoks. You finally out of sport mode? Yes, it's in party mode now. Gosh, it wasn't that long ago that you arrived here in Crumblewood Grove. In order, you have a party in your honor. Really moving on up, little scout. Aw, oh, gee, thanks. I'll never forget my humble beginnings. You were my very first delivery, Shelby. Did you know that? <laughs> yeah, I knew. You were shaking like a little leaf. You were so nervous. No, 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 I wasn't. That's an embellished retelling. Embellished or not, you've come so far, little scout. And you have further to go ahead of you if you're willing to go there. I know you can do it. You put your mind to it. Thank you, Shops. Those are some real kind words. Hey, I only said them. You made them true all by yourself. You do good, kid. Now go on and party. Off I go. Can I talk to them? No. Oh. Oh, Mimi, how delightful to see you. Are you, are you enjoying this petite fête du courrier? At oh, the party? It's splendid. Our good feeling friend has uh, done the honors of funding this event. Knowingly. Some questions are best left on sort, Scout. I understand. How's the art going? Oh, so so. Inspiration comes and goes. You know how it is. Not really. I don't need much inspiration to deliver mail. I suppose not. Well, there is a kuti in the bend over there. Their passion and uh, energy is certainly inspiring me. Who? Who is it? I don't look, don't look. And also, don't ask. I'll never ever tell. Oh, chin up, Mimi. You did great work today. Hope to see you around again soon. Au revoir, Scout. See you soon, stinky crow. I swear, if you come, I, I'm, I'm joking, I'm joking. Bye, Cass. Bye, Mimi. Au revoir. Hello, Max and Max Hat. Hi, both of, from both of us. This isn't my regular hat, though. Oh, it's my party hat. <laughs> it looks identical to your normal hat. Oh, but it is entirely identical in every other way. That's why you greeted it just now. On some instinctive level, you knew it was different. You are over overestimating my instincts. But this is a party, so I'll agree to keep the peace. Good call. And good party. Enjoy it! I will! I will. Dude, having a party only for me. That's amazing. Can we talk? No. Sometimes it's, it's a bit buggy. What about this cutie? Not possible. What about you? Hi, Tuff! Ah, it's Mimi, my favorite scout. What are you doing all the way here? Just take a breather. Not one for parties? Mm, not usual, no. It's mostly the noise. Mario's a bit sensitive. It doesn't take much before it's too much. Ah, oh, well, I'm glad you came either way. There's no wrong way to party. I'm glad you think so. Do you mind if I ask you an honest question? Sure. The mushroom on your hand? Were you born with it? Can you feel through it? And so, what do you feel? I've been wondering this whole time. I have a lot of follow-up questions after these ones. It's not... It's not what? Can you not feel through it? Or only when you're older? Or, uh, heaven forbid, did you have an accident? Tough. 
It's a head. Just a mushroom head. Oh, that makes sense then. Well, you sure picked a good one. It's quite pretty. And only a little bit poisonous. If you had to eat it to survive, you could. But you wouldn't enjoy it. Um, good to know. Thanks, Top. No, thank you for coming to check in on me. Good luck on your next adventure. The same to you. Arigato. Oh, now it's working. What you doing there? Um, I mean, nice to see you, Mimi. What brings you here on this fine morning? I mean, evening. I mean, is there something on Kiki's forehead? What? No. Because you seem to be staring at it pretty intently. Well, for me, coin collecting is just a start. I want many coins. He has many coins. Like, lots. And why spend valuable energy finding out how to go about doing that when I could just steal someone else's idea? Spoken like a true capitalist. You'll go far in this field. You think? Well, I don't hope so. But we'll see. You see, Mimi, I'll make you proud. Don't know if that would be making me proud, but go off, I guess. <laughs> oh, you. This is your party, isn't it? That's what I'm told. Guess you're quite the big shot around here now, huh? Then you're real something. Well, listen here, Bob. This uh, town ain't big enough for two of us. And this kitty's got class. Before you go on, I just want to know... I'm really quite scared. Scared. Uh, square. <laughs> scared. Quivering even. I don't like you two, Mimi. I'll show you when I finally get my... Shoot, what was it again? A deposit? Yep, that was definitely a deposit you signed for. Nothing more? You're sure you delivered it to the right people? I want my stacks now. I went to the right people, all right. <laughs> he said wink out loud. Uh, you, what about it? When I finally get that deposit, I'm buying out the company you work for. Okay, see you then, future boss. Mm -hmm. Okay, he just wants to buy everyone, dude. Hi, recruit. Whoops, I mean, hi, Mimi. Sorry, it's weird to not to be working anymore. No worries. What if I told you that recruit is my middle name? It is? No, my middle name is Garlic. <laughs> Why is your middle name Garlic? Mimi Garlic? Long story, too long for now. So what do you think of the party? I love it. It's nice to see everyone out and about and having fun. I'm glad. When Janet asked for help in organizing the party earlier, it felt right to contribute about after all you've done for me and the gang. You and Janet set up this party? Thank you so much. I guess I was thinking about what we were talking about earlier. About sipping drinks? You do realize that was a metaphor for wealth redistribution, right? <laughs> yeah, I got that. I was thinking about what it likes like it to be busy. I like being busy. Sometimes it feels like relaxing and the, it's the hardest part. The problem starts when I don't get to not be busy. Good night, dear Dust. Thank you again for the bits. I appreciate it. Thank you. But helping out with event planning like this, the relaxing is part of the being busy. And if it's up to me, we'll have a grumble wood to get down every week. No need to worry about the cost. A certain feline friend is fronting the expenses. Well, don't let me keep you from enjoying your first <laughs> party of many. <laughs> oh, just thank you very, very much again for the bits. Thank you. I appreciate it a lot. Have a, have a wonderful night. Sleep well and tight. Thank you again. Thank you very much. Quack, quack. <laughs> you should enjoy it also. It's in your honor. You come to the next party too, right? But miss it for the world, Irene. You're good. Can't wait to see you there. I think we talked to everyone now, but I can't talk to them. So we're going to talk to Irene now. Let's go. You ready to go, Kit? Yep. Are you sure? Sure. No going back. Talk to me when you're ready. Ready. I am ready. Ready. I'm ready to go now. You feeling better? Yeah. You know, thanks for listening to me. Not a problem, Kit. We all need a little support sometimes. I'm still a little scared to tell Mail Scout HQ. But I'll be okay. Yes, you'll be fine. They know deliveries don't always go as planned. You can just come back when it cracks out of hibernation and try again. Then I'll be more prepared. Exactly. You did 44 deliveries today from what I hear. It was not always easy. But I'm so happy I was able to help everyone today. 
sadly because of the crack business, the higher ups won't be able to give you your official male scout patch yet. But don't you worry, kid. <laughs> I'm getting an unofficial male scout patch. That's cute. I got you one right here. Oh, that's cute. Oh, Janet, you stole from work. I'm calling the CEO of May right now. No, no, no. I made you one because you're a true male scout to me. Uh. <laughs> Mimi, are you going to say anything? Janet, you're the best mom a boss could wish for. Uh, no, wait. The best boss a scout could mom. Uh, no. You know what? Doesn't matter. I don't have to be perfect. Thank you, boss. Uh, mo you thank you, mom, boss, Janet. You're not my kid. You know, would never mind. Never mind. Let it out, Scout. Say what you need to say. I'm an unofficial male Scout baby. <laughs> Aw. <laughs> I absolutely love this game. It was super fun to play. I love the story. I love the humor. It's very lighthearted. I'm so glad I played this one. But there's a question mark. Hmm. I didn't want to present though. But that's okay. <laughs> oh, they're working together. The woodpecker. I think the first picture was the mushroom guy. Ah, uh, the bad. <laughs> and I couldn't find the last two. <laughs> Okay, okay. Uh, uh, stealing the Bitcoin, I see. I see. <laughs> very cute game. Yeah, it was very wholesome. <gasps> oh, look at them. They're together. That's so sweet. I'm glad we could bring together those lovebirds. <laughs> oh, eggbirds. And what was her name? Not Anna, right? Anna Bell? No, something like that. I'm still missing a picture here. A second one. <laughs> oh, this is mean. I wanted to see. End of May, ever dream well. I saw, yeah. I saw. I'm excited to see this one. Oh, another picture I don't have yet. <laughs> Ah. <laughs> uh. The capybara. <laughs> Hard nose. Da da da. Da da da. Da 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 da. <laughs> the race <laughs> between two that's sweet everything is sweet definitely wholesome game Damn, I'm still missing lots of pictures. Crazy, huh? Because I didn't uh, get all the items, I assume. <laughs> the cat. <laughs> I like that the cat is the bad guy here, the capitalist. <laughs> Oh, that seems like a nice party. A pool party. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. 
I'm getting teased. I need to I need to get one hundred percent in this game. <laughs> Watching the stars. <laughs> Mm -hmm. All right, uh, my experience so far with Kickstarters, uh, Kickstarter backers, that list might be very long. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna say thank you so much for playing this very wholesome game called Meal Time. Hope you also enjoyed it, and uh, tomorrow I'll be back again at 9 p.m. CST. <laughs> <laughs>